everyone, and welcome to an impatient, apparently, episode of Raw Talking It. I'm your designated gamer, Titus. Over there is the impatient one. That's Joe. He's our backseater. And we are finishing, or not finishing, uh, we're finishing Chapter 8. We're playing yes. Final Fantasy VII Remake, my first time playing it. Um, but yeah, we we pretty sure going to finish Final Fantasy VII eventually, maybe, kind of. I mean, yeah, we're gonna we'll we'll finish the game. But we're finishing chapter eight tonight, probably. Uh, we should. Probably, just, maybe. As long, we should. Otherwise, the title's not gonna make any sense. Yeah, that's why we're getting like right into it. YouTube. Oh yeah, we're doing stuff. All right, so we're going this way. Uh, yes. Follow Oats. Oh, hair is inside me. Oh. Alright, sorry. That was weird. Anyway, uh, why don't you tell the folks why you're impatient? Well, it's the day before Xenoblade 3 comes out. I mean, it's out. It's why did really... you turn into a nervous, like, fifth grader? The day well, it's because you're, like, Xenoblade. you're being weird about it. I don't know, man. Yeah, but, uh, we'll take care of it from here. But there are monsters okay. out there. <laughs> don't worry. I've brought a super strong friend along with me. Super strong. I used to be a soldier. Super so strong. where's the guy? I don't know. He disappeared and we can't find him. Right now, let's worry about the kids. Come on. All right, time to fight some shit. I just love one of these kids. All of these kids are wearing reasonable-ish clothes, except for the kid who's wearing the trashy white tank top that still has it tucked into his jeans like it's 1986. Yeah, like this guy is covered in fucking dirt. Yeah. But He's wearing still has... sandals and a tank top that's tucked in with a belt. Yeah. Like, it's fucking stand by me over here and it still <laughs> look presentable. Oh, this is like the same outfit over here. And then this guy at least has his clean fucking clothes. Oh, you should continue to explore this camp. Don't just wander off. Interact. Oh, she has a flower. She oh, a flower. actually. From Aerith. Oh, I guess that is when you get after you do the first thing, I guess. Whatever. Look at the throne. These guys are egotistical assholes. Oh, this is cool. This is a little ship. I made a little ship. I love this little area. I think it's cool. I think fashion. It's neat. fashion. Yeah, you know, you should take you should take fashion advice from the the married guy and the gay man. That's 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 our news. We're new both street. married guys. What the fuck was that? I know. <laughs> what the fuck? I was know. That? But it's, you get much more credit if you're gay. I I don't. The, uh, uh, wow. I'm I'm hurt. Look, look. Have you seen Queer Eye for this red guy? That show's amazing. <laughs> I actually haven't. You haven't seen it? No, I think oh I've seen clips. God. But like, no, I don't watch. It's it. really good show. To be oh, fair. I'm sure it is. It's a really good show. So you know, you gotta be, you gotta be that guy, you know. And then like, you know, I obviously have no the fashion sense guy? at all. <laughs> I'm the straight guy that has no fashion sense at all, and you're supposed to help us. Why am I playing as this idiot? Jesus. Come on. It's because I think it's because. Um, the Shiva fight messed. Oh, Eric, yeah, because she Eric left was, the party for like a yeah. hot second. Yeah. I got your number. Uh, that's what's going on. All right. Week two. Hmm. Ice attacks, huh? God, so, good thing I fucking um, love that spell. So we, we, I told you the other day, I think I mentioned that on my phone, I picked up Dragon Warrior Monsters again. Because, <laughs> yeah, yeah. because that, I was like, oh, uh, it still Monday, has my save file from like a year ago. So like, I don't know, amazing. I was like, I needed something to do while Jaden was hogging Super. the TV with, with like, I, it, not like I didn't want him to, whatever, but, um. I'm going to tell you so that. He's probably watching stream and he'll probably chime in. I sure hope so. I love him. He's great. But, or he's playing herbs. He picked up herbs again. Uh, but, uh, so number one, the first thing I did was I realized that I, I did some drawing on the back of an, I'm going to make sure this doesn't have like my address on it. I did uh, some drawing on the back of an envelope and realized I could get a monster that I've always wanted. I'm a fucking nerd. Well, there it's hard. Breeding in that game's hard. <laughs> yeah, it is. Uh, um, you can go and, and watch our uh, series on that whole thing. I, that was a trip. But I got Jamaris, which was the boss. As Ooh, a kid, back. he's a boss. He's a, one of the boss fights that doesn't automatically join you. And I thought he was one of the bosses that you could feed to make him join you because there's like four or five of them 
because his whole thing is you find him and he's giving a speech to a bunch of monsters. Oh yeah, that guy. He likes he wants sirloin, sirloin, sirloin. Yeah. So I thought if I gave him a bunch of sirloin, but like I you never sure could get him. And it turns out he's not going to join you no matter what. Um, so I got one of those, and then the other thing is I was looking at some other stuff and I realized I was looking at the different boss class monsters and I was like, oh, I can actually get one of these boss class monsters. I've never actually been able to do it before because they're all pretty hard to get. But I realized I had exactly the right stuff. I only need to go catch like one or two easy things. It was like easy stuff I could work out. And then, so I did that earlier this week. And then two days ago, I realized that I could evolve that boss monster into another boss monster. Because it was one of the, like most of those recipes Boss on boss on boss on boss on boss. You like they go further and further. So I actually have two boss monsters right now. Two. Or sorry, sorry, no. I have one. I I he's at the second stage. He took the first boss monster as as a parent. Um. So this is my team right now, and I'm like really happy about it. And seeing the guy on the left, mm. Jamaris, just makes me very happy that I have him on my team. I think it's very funny that like you have this interesting nostalgia to this just one-off, like, fucking Dragon Quest game that was supposed to basically just copy Pokemon. I mean, one of these days, I really should play the DS remakes or the mm -hmm, sequel. Because, mm -hmm. like, there's a whole sequel, there's remakes. There's, yeah, there's a stuff. whole second one, and then there's, um, like, the but, Joker series. Yeah, the Joker are the remakes. Yeah. And supposedly they're better in most ways. <laughs> well, I mean, it's not hard. They, the game was made refined. in, like, 1994. Well, it cake. refines some mechanics and things. But, specifically... Jamaris was the one on the left, and then, yeah, um, the one on the right is Baramos, which most of the boss monsters, boss class stuff, are things that appear in later games, or they're outright bosses in the later games, and so this guy is, is Baramos, I think, who's, I, he's like a major boss in Dragon Age, like, 4, or something like that? Or yeah, we, we talked about this. Some, yeah, so a few of them basically are, are different bosses from different games, but, um, yeah, and also, now that I've actually really put some time and invested in these, and also leveled them up a bunch, I'm just, I'm, I'm working my way through the story, that's for sure. I'm about to get to the point where we quit on the stream, which was the final, the Starry Night Tournament or whatever, yep. except we got there and we lost a bunch, and we couldn't beat it. Yeah. So, I need to go train the monsters. Because that game is, uh, that game is not easy. No, it's not, and I need, I, so I need to go... The new monster I just bred, obviously, is level 1, so I need to go level it up a bunch. It's going to take a little while, but that has been an easy thing for me to do since um, Jane's actually occasionally using the TV every now and then. So when he's using the TV, I chill on the couch, and I've been playing this on my phone, um, which has been fun. Oof. It's a shame Prey isn't better. It's fine. But I also did not, I did not bother to level up that material, and I probably should have. It's probably a really good deal. I bet it's probably one of those situations where if you actually level it up all the way, it's like the best heal in the game or whatever. It doesn't cost mana to heal, I know, which is kind of nice. Which on Aerith, who's constantly using mana to have that, it just costs ATB. It, it is really nice. Um, by the way, it's, it's pretty soon. It's not right yet, but it's pretty soon. That the that the game will open up for side quests. But uh, she has really low HP pool. Basically. She does. I think I had the HP up material once I had enough spots for it. I think she was the one who was using. I gave her HP up and MP up most of the time. Yeah, seems kind of necessary. Once I can get like, once I can get there is the problem. Yeah, and you want and obviously we're we're trying to level up a bunch of different materials at once. Um. So that makes sense. Too damn many. But I guess when I level up the fire materia, I mean. Oh, oh have you completed her weapon skills? Uh, For the guard stick. Uh, yeah. Oh, okay, I didn't yeah. know. I think I think it was just like heal allies or something Easy. like that. But I didn't know. Easy peasy. Squeeze. Uh oh, it's just use the ward. Yeah, arcane ward is so busted. Yeah, That's, good. It's so. Freaking stupid! It's so good. I'm gonna fight that guy. Oh yeah, you have to use the sonic strike. Probably strikers. like a couple more. All right, so those guys are gonna come uh, to life probably or pop out of so. Anyway, it's gonna be fine. It's gonna be. Fine. What do you think's gonna? What do you think they're gonna come to life? We're gonna have some. <laughs> some of this junk is gonna be. Junky. I actually think these monsters have a really cool design. I I think they're really cool. Hold on. 
Oh, excuse me. Um, uh, we were the other thing we were talking about. We were talking about Fire Emblem Heroes. The Choose Your Legends uh, stuff comes out. I think it's in August when that stuff usually when the heroes are revealed and then they come out at the end of the month or something like that. And it's this year. It's oh shit, he silenced me. Krom and Tiki from Awakening One, which is so weird to me that it took them this long to win because early days in Fire Emblem Heroes, Awakening was the one that got all the love. They got all the new units, they got all the the events and things. Um, and they kind of... They did so much for so long that they actually now at this point don't. <laughs> There's not that much Awakening anymore. If anything, Three Houses gets the love. Because um, uh, that wasn't out when Heroes came out. But uh, with those two coming to the game, I like both those characters a lot, and then the runner-ups were Female Byleth from Three Houses, and Selif, who, I don't know, they're just all really good characters, they all deserve to win, it's been too long for some of them to have won yet, so uh, I'm excited, but I will definitely have to spend some money, probably, to get them. I'd have to, I'd have to get exceptionally lucky to not. It'd be fun. No uh, everybody is poisoned. I don't know if you can do anything about that. Yeah, and maybe I don't do think you have. About I don't it. think you have poison right now. So. It'd be fine. Um, yeah, the smoggers are. They're kind of tough to deal with. But no, I'm really excited to see what they do with the units because Krom also has a bunch of alts already, and the Choose Your Legends they always give them different weapons. So like, I don't know what they're gonna give him because he already has like three different sword alts and he also already Whoa. has uh like two different archery alts whoa what the so, fuck oh those things explode when they're done yes the smokers do the smokers do explode when they're done oh god that was annoying as hell yes it is Go on. um we're gonna healing wind here yeah so you have your limit so do it do it to it you haven't seen it yet whatever Refocus, by the way, is really You're good. Still doing okay, it, right? it is a very good limit break for... This is not, like, that long and that difficult of a battle, but for the really long ones, whoever you... Because right now, obviously, Aerith came with Refocus equipped, but you can put it on any character. It is a really solid one to have. Um, obviously, it takes a while to get your limit break gauge up, but then being able to do actions significantly more frequently is just very, very powerful. Oh, she killed it. Okay. Hey, look, it did get up. Look, I thought it was going to. Yep. Yep. I'm just gonna remember that it's gonna freaking um. Explode. Explode when it's done. Oops. They are also. I don't know if you have. Uh, did you do an assess already? Yeah. Oh yeah. Okay. Yeah, they are in fact weak to thunder. Yep. Um. Oh, you got the Oh, there we go. I mean, no, he doesn't need to cast that much. Still. And you got your limit. That is great. You're fine. Go on. Just, just go away. Alright, we're gonna do this. Calling lightning. Oh. Oh! I don't know what Jesus. that red thing is. I don't know what that red thing is. It did it before as well. Oh, no, you're talking for thunder damage. Oh, because you were in the ward, so you also got yeah. to do it twice. Yeah. Yeah. That was kind of crazy. Political calls? Scam likely calls. Don't trust what you hear or see. You I received know. a call from Scam Likely. That's so funny. I had not actually seen that before, and now my phone does it all the time. Deedy, cool. deedy, deedy. That's my wife's ringtone when someone calls. Okay. Is the. Up. Oh, you don't remember that? From Dungeons no. and Daddies? What, wait, what? The I remember. Deedy, 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 deedy. It's no, uh, Anthony being scam likely and doing waiting music. 
Oh yeah, it's no, I don't very know. funny. But uh, if you're a Patreon, you can get that as a ringtone. Oh, that's really good. It's yeah. very good. That's really good. I listened. What? To, I, I did listen to this week episode. This week's episode. I have not. I'm gonna listen to it tomorrow. It is very good. Uh, it definitely. It was a bit of a slower episode, but it was really good. I, I, still, I still really like. I it. don't mind them slowing it down a bit. <laughs> I, they, yeah, they... Because they've been like going, they, like, balls to the wall, and so, like... I think they had a lot of ideas they were trying to work through in a short, and they knew they needed to get the, it all out in the first so many episodes. Like, it's not scripted, but obviously they... There are plans, right? Like, Anthony's right. crafting a story. Right, yeah. And everyone is collectively telling a story, and so, uh, yeah. Now, they're in... They're in a new situation, obviously. Uh, and I thought this episode was really good. Um, definitely, uh, definitely curious with what they're going to do about one aspect, which I had forgotten about, and then I was like, oh, oh no, they yeah. have to deal with that now. Yes. I don't know yes, if you know what I'm talking about. Yes, they do. It's the part of the last episode. I might have. Of the one before this week's. What? A certain something that they decided to go visit. No, 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 no. They have to oh. deal with... They have to deal with. I don't. I you'll you'll get there when you get there, but it's uh... Ugh, I, uh yeah. It's not like the most spoilery thing in the world, but the the time problem. Oh, like the yeah, the time reverse polarity thing that they established yeah. canonically. Yes, they did which they have to continue to deal with. Uh, anyways, they, they they address it, and it's going to be really interesting. I don't know what the fuck they're going to do about it. <clears throat> um, just full stop. I don't know. Moving forward, I don't know what they're going to do. <laughs> they're Very gonna, curious. They're going to have to figure it out. Anthony's really good at writing stories, though. Yeah, I just... It's, it's one of those things where also, though, I feel like he is absolutely willing to let things play out like he probably has a contingency contingency plan and has probably thought about you know like this is the way i want them to handle it this is the way i think they're gonna figure out to handle it but if they don't and if they choose to do blah 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 what am i gonna do about that and uh he probably has a contingency for that so we'll have to just see but yes this week's episode is really good still only an hour but it was really good whoops miss yeah, I think they've said kind of like, like they're just gonna keep doing only hour long. I think that's better. The two episodes were they were hard to find the time to listen to. They could drag on sometimes. So I think this is probably better long long term. But yeah, probably. But I hope they also I hope they slow down the the pacing, but still keep the hour long episodes. But we'll see. Ugh, what a good show. These what kids are just show. like yelling about who's slashing around and how they sound when they're slashing around. Yeah. Oh my god, I'm doing the worst thing in the world. I have I have really thick calluses on some of my toes. And I'm sitting in my chair and I'm just picking at some of the calluses. And now that I've, and now that I've picked at them, they're bad. Yeah, don't do that. And then they're getting more. I want to pick them more. Mm-mm. What's be doing that? No, I need to stop. Is Tifa like your girlfriend? Yes. No. Oh. But she's someone special. It's not like that. More like. I don't know how to explain. I see. Mm hmm. You could have said yes right there. No one would have questioned you. I don't think she cares. I don't think, I don't think cares. I don't think Aerith's interested in Cloud you at all. Trouble, You're wrong. Me you'll find an adult, okay? At least not right okay. now she isn't. I, will. I don't know if she is. And here, since you're so cool. Since you're so cool. Thanks, kid. You're also one of us now. You can come and play here whenever you want. Well, thanks, dog. I appreciate that. Um, Can I go slash monsters up? Is that a thing we can do? 
Um, the monsters respawn in this area? Uh, you will be back there later for a side quest, so don't worry about it right now. You okay. will go back there. You don't need to worry about it right this second. Fine. I was just trying you, you to literally see. Have, you literally have an entire side quest that's about going back, <laughs> going into back that there? little area. Yeah. Nice. Reusing assets 101. Hey, man, might as well. When you put this much money into a freaking engine, you might as well. Like... I know, right? Like... <sighs> That said, what the we see. Yeah. Oh. Don't worry, it'll be okay. What the hell is this about? Wait. Hmm. Not him. It looks pretty damn similar. Why do you look like Organization 13? There's the number, but why two? Who knows? The, the reunion. Nothing to fear. Oh, you're fucking scary, dude. FF7R3 is definitely going to be called FF7R, FF7 Reunion. It's gotta Probably. Be. It's, it's gotta be. You don't know who Sephiroth is, do you? Sephiroth, the war hero? I know he died in an accident five years ago. They said so on the news. The war hero. Yeah, he did. But I've got a feeling he's still alive. Oh, right. Come on, let's go. All right, okay, yeah, that was that was that was a cutscene. That happened, right? Sure, sure, bro. Why do you look like the Ghostbusters? Mm hmm. My dad told me that that man he used to be a soldier when he was younger. Huh. But the ban it, ban it. Hey, Cloud. I know a lot of people around here need help. When I'm out on patrol. A lot of them tell me about their problems. Thank you for telling me that there's side quests. In helping out? Well, I'm all for it. We Bro, there's a Moogle behind me. Yes, finally. Don't worry, I give you permission. I always have the latest information. Come find me if you want to know. Bro, look at this child dressed up as a Moogle. This is the funniest shit know. ever. Is that a Moogle? Right? You right? Me, then you two must be very, very special people. In that case, welcome to the Moogle Emporium. I'm the owner, Moggy. You must not be familiar with Mog the Moogle. It's a pretty famous fairy tale. I mean, everyone's familiar with Mog. Wanted to bring happiness to all the Moogles of the forest, so he decided to open a shop of wonders. Yeah. That's right, Koopa. I open a store to bring happiness to the slums, like Mog. And you know, only people with the purest of hearts can even see Moogles. Uh. Oh my lord. Well, Magic isn't perfect, Koopa. He even says Koopa afterward. Kinds of rare and wondrous goods. They can help us if you've got enough Moogle medals. But you'll need to buy a membership first. Buy a membership card with a Moogle okay. with a single Moogle medal. Yes. Also the Moogle theme. Or whatever this theme is. This it's from Kingdom Hearts. What? Da, 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 da. I don't yeah. think it's Kingdom Hearts music. It sounds very familiar to how a Kingdom Hearts mix does. But Kingdom Hearts has Moogles as well. Well, yes, this is yes. Well, you know what? So, I, I will say... That's the duty of every Moogle. Of course, just like Mog the Moogle. Just like Mog the Moogle. New merchandise is available. I see you're working hard, uh, Mr. You Murph. will have an opportu yep. opportunity, even after this so chapter, to spend Moogle hard. medals. As you always do, I'm sure. You know. Oh, so is, is that side quest done? Huh? Really? Yeah, I think so. Maybe. I thought you were just doing I it for fun. Is, yeah. I suppose some people do. Oh, you're Hello. right. I think it's some saucer. people. Nice to meet you. Yep. First playthrough. Um, so the Moogle medal 
the Moogle Shop. Oh, that's you, that theme is the gold saucer to, theme. You will not be able to afford everything right now, but you will be able to afford you will be able to afford everything eventually. I need this um, graveyard key. So yes, you need the key. You want to buy the staff. You should have a decent. You have a ton of Moogle medals right now. Um. Frankly, I don't think you need the accessories. I don't think they're that good. Um, so I would buy the staff, the keys, and then honestly, the other ones are just like free SP. This is all SP? It's SP for your weapons. Oh, yeah. Increases skill points for Cloud. So for pick Barret, whichever. For Tifa, and then for... Hey, they spoil who's on the party. So you only can afford two. Pick whichever two you want. If you want to buy the other stuff, then you... What now? The, oh, the thing. And yeah. then this one, this one seems okay. Enter with a slightly failed ATB gauge. That's not terrible. There is there is a there is a materia for that later too. Also, I got a BRB. I, I officially picked that callus too much, so I'm gonna keep my headphones <laughs> Did on. Did you make but... your hand bleed, you goober? No, it's on my I said it was on my toe. Oh, okay. Sorry. It's, but I have a big piece of crusty skin hanging off, you know, how calluses be. Uh yeah, it's golden it's, saucer. And it's gonna, it's gonna bleed if I, uh, if I just pull it off. So I have, to, I need to cut it off. Some clippers. Like for real though, I have, I have terrible calluses on my feet. <laughs> um, let's go really with Aerith. And you're using Aerith and Cloud right now, so like. Go with Cloud, I guess too. Why not? It's not a bad idea. You, like I said, you will come back later, and you will have an opportunity to spend more. To not to mention, you will earn more. You will earn more Moogle medals just in this chapter alone, Maybe and you will probably be able to buy more. So, I'm happy. Go on, yeah, but it's just it, and it's applied to all Make of your weapons for that character. He'll need a lot more medals, Kupo. Well, that won't do. Come on, Cloud. Let's go get more. Good luck, guys. Oh, you didn't say Kupo at the end. You're a bad Moogle. What a bad Moogle. He only does it half the time. It's funny. Yeah, he, it's like he's trying to remember that he has things to say, and so he like says um, it half the time. The, uh, I like I like Cloud's attitude of being like he's like pretending to be a hard ass to the kids. Yeah, to encourage them to work harder. Like I actually think that's adorable. Um, but yes, Silver Staff time. Also, you have so much SP on these weapons. Holy cow. Yeah, I don't know where it I'm came sorry, from. Corbin. I didn't did I need to talk about my toe calluses? No, probably not. But did I? But I but I did do that. Yeah, I, I did do that. Um <laughs> But yeah, I did. They're really bad. I've said I've said for years that what I need I I need a pedicure, but I don't just need a pedicure. I need and this is gonna not the best way to say this, I recognize that. But I need a pedicure not just from anyone. But by but a pedicure from like an angry Vietnamese woman at a at a hole in the wall pedicure manicure shop who's like angry. She's having a bad day. She doesn't speak a lick of English and she needs to take her anger and frustration out on my calluses. That's what I need. I know this is recorded. It's on the Internet forever. No, oh, we can't say things like that. Yeah, we can. Oh my god! <laughs> oh boy. <sighs> Alright. <laughs> Alright. You know what? Fuck it. Why not? I'm, I'm just. I, I, I did my best to preface that with what I was. What I meant. I. We're already here, I guess. Okay. That's what I need. I need the most talented person to be incredibly angry. <laughs> yeah. That's the kind of callous energy that I'm dealing with here. <laughs> kind of callous. Holy crap! I don't know if oh. I want to use the other one. Well, I you can need get to, more materia slots on this You do one. need to, at the very least, unlock the skill. Yeah, I'll do well, that. Well, remember, one of those is just a connection. So one of them was a new slot, but one of them was connected slots. But yeah, I don't know if the silver staff has. But I mean, it's still four. Three. 
It's it is four versus three. Well, equip the silver staff for a few minutes until you get the the skill. Um, and right. you will get it. You will get to fight some stuff. And the skill, because what's the skill? Uh, the lightning thing. Tempest? No, not Tempest. Uh, Sorcerer's Storm. Oh, see, yeah, that one's really good. The only thing about that one is, is that it's AOE centered on Aerith. So it's not like the best thing in the world. It's also really easy to unlock because it's just hit two or more enemies on a skill that has a very low, like, hit animation. Like, you can just get, you can knock it out. Um, do you have the side quest now? Kids on patrol. Not yet. There's a bunch of little things, though. Okay. Kids on patrol is... is preferably the next one I would like you to do. <clears throat> that, yeah, that, that song sounds very familiar, or very um, similar to a Kino Hearts theme that happens a lot. I mean, maybe they used the Golden Saucer theme, who knows? They, yeah, I'm, that's what I'm saying, is I think they might have used a little bit of inspiration from the Golden Saucer. Wait. Go back into the kids' place. I'm sorry. Aerith, you're back! I think there's another quest in there. The flowers. Unless, I mean, I guess you can go Great collect job. quests. That's, That's also fine, too. I'm doing. But oh, I think beautiful. there's something you can do there still. And I can't. I Shinra suit walking towards your house a little while ago. He was dressed all in black. A little scary looking. Oh, no. Say it with flowers. That's the plot. You are not allowed to go back to Aerith's house. They promised me. Alright, who's this lady? What you oh. doing? You're that former soldier, aren't you? Yes. Cloud, was it? Kind of. Former soldier turned problem solver. Turned Your problem face solver? Face. Look at us. We're going you up in the upset. world, man. Uh, yeah, I am pretty upset. The kids are still off doing patrols, even though it's now time for their lessons. Not a single one of them has come back yet. Patrols? Is that a leaf house thing? Something they do to help out? Ah. That's right. In return for the donations we receive, I'm almost kids finishing go around beer, town picking up litter, running errands, hey, that kind of thing. I'm almost finishing my drink, I don't too. I suppose you've seen any of them, have you? Oh. You see, I have some important plans this evening, and I really need to go and get ready. Would you like us to go round them up? Oh, that would she be has a wonderful. date, that's what that means. There are five of them out on patrol right now. Um, they all you'll find out. swords on their backs, so they should be easy to spot. Swords on their backs, huh? One boy patrols near some concrete pipes. One girl likes to do These kids are actually kind of hard to find, and they don't give you specific markers of where they are. One boy spends most of his time checking out the shops. Uh, One girl loves to be fussed over by folks at the community center. You tell, tell me where all they are. There's so many of them, though. Holy shit. Forget, I know. They all wear homemade swords on their backs. Thanks again for agreeing to help you guys. God, so many of these kids. You kids have parents? Fuck. Also, go inside the leaf house, too. There's, I think there's a chest in there. You've already been in there. Oh, if you've already been in there and got the chest, that's fine. I've already been in here. Look, there's nothing here. Oh. Look, sandals. Uh, and then the community center has a jukebox, too. Yup. Um, yup. 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 Which I think has a song that you... Maybe you picked up last time, but I don't think you did. Yeah, Kids on Patrol, which is that quest you just got, also gives you another weapon. We have so many. So many what? So many uh, songs. You do. Yeah, I need to look that up later to see if um, they used inspiration from... From Gold Saucer for the. Uh... There's a quest right by the center too. You walked right by it, I think. Let's go right here. Oh, there's one of the kids on patrol. Oh, hey there. Do they all have swords on their back that look like mine? A lot more people yeah. On the streets than usual. Goobers. I think it's hilarious. Well, How do they make the swords that quick? <laughs> I mean, I assume that the Buster Sword important? is standard issue military oh, gear if Cloud's a soldier and he wears it. That is... Not true? It could be true. I mean, I guess it could be now. I don't know. I don't Who know knows? how it's anymore. Um, but yeah, there's a quest back by the community center. 
there's like a doctor standing outside. Find these kids. I mean, yeah, I'm just trying to be a little more efficient. I mean, I gotta the, return back that way anyway. They're just all over the place, is the thing. So, you have a lot of quests to do, a lot of quests to pick up. But you, you do you. This is, you're the one playing the game. I am. I've been watching them real close. I'm trying to learn all about the business. You want to open up a shop of your own someday? Don't do it, kid. Yeah. Shop ceremony pit. And use it to help the house. Teachers don't like to talk about it. We know the donations aren't enough to keep things running. What was your bit of news you said was interesting? Did we have it already? Oh, 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 no, we didn't. We didn't talk about it already. Ah, oh, excuse me, one sec. Sorry, I had some sniffles. Um, uh, so apparently... Hey there, how goes the patrol? The... So, a few years back, there was a Tomb Raider movie. Mm -hmm. Yeah, with Angelina Jolie. No, the one with Alicia Vikander. There was another one? Yeah, just like five years ago. Yeah, 2018. Yeah. I don't remember this. It released a very modest success. Like, it didn't lose money or anything. Um, and honestly, I thought it was pretty good. Oh, right, yeah, yeah, yeah. Well, you did mention that you've seen a Tomb Raider yeah. movie. I happened to see it. For whatever reason, I happened to see most of it. Um, not super paying attention to it. But, like, it was good. It was a fun little action flick. It was a it was a perfectly fine movie. Um, actually, there, it, it definitely took more inspiration from the more modern Tomb Raider. And, but, and it was All right, good. So, so not triangle tits. Got it. Yeah, not trying. And not like, <laughs> I'm a super sexy Angelina Jolie. She's like a more... Look at my ass and my short shorts and my booty. She's a more well-rounded character. <laughs> and it also more directly ties in with the stories in the games. God, I'm so glad Thunder doesn't watch this podcast. He messaged not that long ago. <laughs> Anyways, um, the movie's good. And if you, like, as far as video game movies go... It is perfectly fine. Um, Five of them, but like apparently, miles. basically, the studio that owns the it the they come back town, had a disaster. limited they time to decide really if they wanted to, to make a sequel and continue their ownership of the rights of you the will? movie rights oh, of it to mm -hmm. possibly make another movie. Or, uh, and Some they have basically they forfeited that by they not they look making or committing to making another movie. So currently... The the movie rights for the Tomb Raider brand are like up for grabs, so different studios are bidding on it to try to get it, basically. So there's a possibility that uh, right, I've gotten one at the concrete pipes, one in the shops, four. one four, and you need there's one more. Um, where was the last one? Man, I was trying to tell you to go do other stuff, and you'll bump into them as you go. I don't no. know. <laughs> no. They're not on your map. That's the problem. They're not on your map. It's fine. I'll go talk to them. Maybe. Corbin, I, it's not like a great movie, but I thought it was perfectly serviceable, especially as a video game movie. Like, it was fine. One girl loves to be fussy. I, I don't. The I don't really have anything to complain about, know. other than they it's just like it's not like amazing. It was fine. Thanks again for agreeing to help um, But yeah, apparently, basically, they chose not to make a, uh... Oh, did you just not get the community center? Yeah, I did not get the one in the community She's center. right there. Also, get that damn quest outside the community center now. I don't know what the fuck you're talking about. There's no fucking quest here. There, the doctor, is he not giving you a quest? No! There's no fucking icon to give me a quest. I saw, I thought I saw. I you a super important question? I heard He's smoking a pipe, that guy. Did I have a quest for you? Oh, the Is icon I saw was for the little girl. Okay, no. I'm sorry. The doctor gives you a quest later. Right now. I thought it was the doctor. <laughs> it lined up. <laughs> so be it. Yeah. That's everyone. Basically, uh, there was a uh, there was a writer who was like writing a sequel, but she's left the project. Oh no. Uh, Alicia Vikander, who was who played Lara Croft, she's out. She's not oh. attached to the project anymore. She's a part of Avalanche, because she has a stamp. Um, okay, everyone. Come inside. Well, stamp's corporate propaganda. Is it? 
Yeah, you guys, they are uh, Avalanche's co-opting Stan so that it we seems less suspicious. Mm. The Toad King? A weird the Toad King? Let's go fight this thing. Lately. Yes. He wears a crown and walks around like he owns the place. If he's not a king, he's got to be monster royalty at least. I bet a soldier could beat him up easy. Damn right. Yeah, real easy. Corbin, I think I think Tomb Raider can work. I do agree that I wish they just told an original story instead of using the video game story. I would agree. Video games are meant to tell stories over the course of like anywhere from ten to a hundred hours, and a movie is at most gonna be two, two and a half for most things, especially an adventure movie. So I think they would be better off um, not leaning on existing stories. But I don't like I don't mind the idea of them using. The idea well, of a character. The problem help, is, is that they need to. to kill it is they they can't rely. You can't just do yet another Don't origin story, you. which this new one was <gasps> ultimately like Lara well, Croft's first adventure right again. King jobs. Looks like it's your lucky day. I mean, I don't disagree with that Corbin at all. I I I mean, look at what happened to Uncharted. Um, yeah, it's it was still a because... major problem because they tried to do a vid the, the video game story. And that was just not it, Chief. <laughs> well, and I, what I saw, too, was some people saying that the Uncharted games... I've never played an Uncharted game, but what I've been told is, or what I've read, is that they rely on the Excuse me. the the cool set pieces, and they, they rely a little less on, like, oh an God. interesting and good plot. <laughs> and I think one of the issues... Those, okay, those movies were made by the same guy, yes. and he's, like... He he's a bad filmmaker in general. He's very he's, bad. He's a specific problem, and so while I definitely do think it's okay to shit on those movies, it's also okay to like those movies if you don't mind them. I don't mind but the like, first one, to be honest with you. But so... like those movies are made by the same dude who's the husband of Mila Jovovich, which is why Mila Jovovich is in all of those movies, and he's like just in it for the money. He's, he's, he, as an individual, is not interested in adapting the video games to be good, interesting movies. The new um, Resident Evil movie looks kind of fucking insane, to be honest. I thought that was um, out, or there was like a show, and I thought it did very poorly. But maybe I'm thinking of something else. Oh, is it the show? The one on... there was... Oh, there might be a show. Is yeah, there's Hulu? a Raccoon City show, and I've heard it's not good, what unfortunately. About... Is that what it is? Is it was it a show? I thought it was supposed to be a movie. I'm pretty good at no, protecting I thought it was a show and, a and I think it did not do well. It looked fucking creepy. Um I heard that it I don't remember what I heard. I heard it wasn't good. I think I heard something along the lines of it. It's not Resident Evil at all. It's just like horror. Not even that. It's just like not Oh, oh. did you have did you, did you use that skill? Yeah, I killed all horrors. Let me get me. Oh, what you're looking it up. Frozen Evil. I do think it's a show. Television series. And I I do not think it did well. 2022, one season. Welcome to New Raccoon City. Yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. 53% of users like the show. Oh, okay. No, it it looked creepy at first. Um. But yeah, I think... If, honestly, I think mm. if any video game movie has a shot of actually being good, it's going to be the new Mario movie, purely on the grounds that Nintendo has such Nintendo has such high standards. Yeah, it's true. At least these days they do. Obviously, the OG Mario movie did happen, and it was a, a clusterfuck. But I think modern Nintendo has such a tighter control on what their IPs are and do that I think that this new Mario movie will probably be a perfectly fun time. Um, we'll see. There's, there's, we'll see. We don't know, but like, I feel like it's actually going to be probably pretty good. All I hope so. Said. I hope so. I hope so. Um, but yeah, I think it's it's hard to adapt video games because video games inherently try to tell stories over longer periods of time. They are different. They're just fundamentally different in a lot of ways, and that makes them. And I think, different. like, Corbin, you just really hit a really big point. You have to find a good writer and enough money to invest into a video game movie that people are going to care about. That's the hard part. Just right there. Ultimately, most people don't play video games still. Yeah. Most people don't play games, but most people see movies, or at least watch them. So, like, if you want to make a video game movie, you have to make a movie first. And it's tough. Um, I think that I do think that the modern 
Nothing to it. These days, uh, more and more creative teams are leaning into the idea of miniseries and shows. Mm -hmm. Um, mm -hmm, mm -hmm, mm -hmm. You get more time to tell your story. I think that's very clever. I think it's very good. And I think that... You know, it's the fucking that. Toad King. Toad King's so cool. With you. Let's go. He's great. Also, this fight is kind of tough, so just make sure you read that assess and be careful. Um, yeah, I definitely think I definitely think we're, we will. The Sonic movies. Sonic are, movies are good. They're perfectly fine. They're, are they great movies? No, but they're fine. Really? I thought they were. I thought they were pretty good. I mean, yeah, pretty. They're just not like. They're not great. They're not gonna enter the like. Oh, I don't. I don't, ex I don't expect. I don't, don't expect no. any video game movie to be the most fucking su right. smashing success ever. I don't just need there to be a Mass Effect movie that's the next Interstellar, right? Like, I just, like, if I'm wanting a video game movie, it's probably just going to be an adventure rock. It's basically all you can really do with it. Um, so, we'll just have to see. Man, yeah, I forgot. You do need to... This fight's hard. <laughs> uh, it's okay. I think the Toad King has special rules about how he takes damage. But yeah, but anyways, the news was Bro, just that. Bro, that attack is really annoying. I'll tell that one right now. This is hard. It's not so bad. Whoa, that attack. <laughs> I told you it's hard. No, no, it's fine. I fucking wiped out one of them in like one hit. It was yeah, you're easy. right. Sonic, Sonic has little to no lore to speak of. And frankly, the in-game lore of the Sonic games has never made a lick of sense, and they know it. Like, there's people, but also animals, but, like, the, it's very unclear what any of the actual lore of Sonic is. It, there is none. Uh, so, I, yeah. And then there's games where, it's, then you have games where it's like, Kirby, like, what the fuck are you gonna do with Kirby? Um, but then you have stuff like, they're making a Dragon Age show, and based on the premise of what they've laid out, there's a, a very reasonable possibility that's going to be a great show. Um, well, I mean, look at The Witcher, though. Like, The Witcher show is incredible. The Witcher has done really, really well, even though I haven't seen it or played Witcher, but, like, it's supposedly very good. Um, yeah, despite the problems that Sonic Forces has in certain other things, I have heard that... Uh, it's a perfectly reasonable... It's not as bad as something that would have to be. Bro, it's this no, fucking no dude Sonic will music. not chill out. <laughs> uh, yeah, I'm trying to look at other video game movies or shows. Like I said, the Dragon Age one is super exciting. The fact that Bioware is possibly getting into that, it also makes sense for them, too, because Bioware, they've always been releasing books. Like, Dragon Age has, like, six in canon novels uh mass effect has like four or five different books that are even occasionally referenced by the games so like bioware is very familiar with the idea of this like extra storytelling venue um and they're not all perfect i think they've actually addressed that one of their books straight up has like an inconsistency that they've had to be like yeah we missed that uh it's like they stated the time of a certain event i'll show you what i can um, do like the some like basically the time that somebody was born and they were just like, oops, that was off by two years and we just messed that up. <laughs> we just like straight up got that wrong. Um, but yeah, I I think there's possibilities, but yeah, I do think most of those possibilities lie in the in the TV show sphere, as opposed to the. Uh, um, okay, now this will be easier. I know you've been you've been gamer mode concentrating. This fight's hard. <laughs> I'm just fucking killing them because all they do is fucking jump around is just like really really annoying. Oh no, I know, I know, I'm with you. By the way, don't forget you have assess all now. So if you assess at all, you you hit every single enemy. You don't right. need to cast them. Oh, did you just snooze me, you motherfucker? I got this. Oof. Gotcha. Yeah, yeah, I do have to stagger him. These could make for actually good shows and movies. Like I, I maintain that I don't think Zelda will ever work. 
I just mm. don't think there yeah, was. Yeah, I don't, I don't think so. Don't I think something, and it's okay to have some things be experienced as a game. That's yeah. fine. That's the, like, that's the crazy shit about this, right? I was gonna try, I was gonna say something before this fight started. It's like, video game movies are the same thing as movie video games. They're, they're the exact same just garbage nonsense. You can safely return. You don't need to hang around. Um, are you sure? Uh, my list does not have anything that you need to pick up okay. back here. So I mean, yes. we can always, we can always go. Worst um, case, you can come back, but I don't have anything on my list of missable stuff. That but you're like, if you look at like the the PS2 era, like almost every single like action movie had a goddamn video game come out about it. Well, they all they still. Well, they don't really do that anymore. They no. still, a lot of them still have books and stuff, but mm -hmm. you're right. Well, like if you take the Harry Potter movie or the Harry yeah the Harry Potter books and movies, and they made video games of them. Oh my God, Harry of the exact oh. like book four, book three, book five, I mean whatever. Now we have the Hogwarts thing, which is a whole separate yeah, thing, right? Yeah, and that's a whole issue nowadays too, because the fandom has been trying to distance themselves from rolling, but like. That's a whole thing. If I love the guy. Exactly. See what I mean? Like, but those, like, genuinely are not that great of games. They're low budget. Crank them out the door. Try and make money off them. And then it's the same thing. In my opinion, it's the same thing when people want to take a video game and make it a movie. They're like, well, let's try yeah, to do this with, like, or whatever, with yeah. like a decent, decent budget. Not crazy. Not put our like a team into this and just try to kick this out and make money off it because the fans will gobble it up. Did you defeat the Toad King? Yeah. The only thing yeah. that matters is is kick this butt real selling good. tickets. And even if everybody leaves the theater and hates it, if they all paid for tickets, it doesn't matter. Exactly. If it makes its money back, it doesn't matter. Thank you so yeah. much. Here, um, this is for you. Oh yeah, this. So here's the deal. Okay, kids. This weapon Play sucks. Over for now. Yeah. It's really bad. So it everyone. mostly is that it has a different One attack I pattern. You to finish today. And Understood? it uh, yes. Yes, get the skill and get out on this weapon. This is one of the only weapons that I'm like, I if you want to try to make this weapon work, buy more power to you, but I don't, I don't think you're gonna. Secrets. Just oh, get the skill and get out. Easier said than done. They're always on the move, looking for new adventures. Chasing new dreams. Oh, we'll try to make oh, their we'll lives make the better. Lives everyone around them just a little bit better. I try to make sure they don't stumble and fall. And when they finally do, I help them back up. Hmm. Sounds exhausting. <laughs> Sometimes it is. But I want the children to know that until they can stand on their own two feet, that I'm here to support them, care for them, love them. That even if we're not actually related, we're still a family. Oh, she a loves the family. kids. In all the ways that matter. If I can do that for them, then, well, then maybe I'm making this world a better place. I know you are. My predecessor taught me everything I know. I just took up his torch and ran with it, I guess. Uh, not that I'm anything close to what he was. Biggs is one of a kind. <gasps> oh no! I've completely lost track of time! Oh no! Do you have somewhere you need to be? On a date? More like a dream I need to fulfill. Thank you again for your help. We need to go on your date. I wonder what kind of dream she's chasing tonight. Hmm. No idea. You'll she find out what it is. But, uh... Return, um, I love I that... Everyone know you guys can join the game, uh, the idea that Biggs... If you want to know mm -hmm. more, then come to ...was the running the Leaf House. Yeah, that's really cool. Yes! Yes! Alright, so what is this skill on this freaking one? Um... The nail. Oh my the god. The nail bat. <laughs> yeah, because it starts from scratch. Oh, I just got move. Um, Tyrius. This one, it says strike three or more enemies. Again, it when it says strike three or more enemies, that does mean with the weapon skill. I figured it's one. Yeah. But unlike Triple Slash, it's a little harder. God, I'm um, really gonna miss equipping that weapon. The Iron Blade. Mm -hmm. You Honestly, Cloud's best weapons are yet to come. Ooh, I could go back to the Buster Sword. 
You could. I never okay. did. I went back to the Iron Sword after the Nail Bat, but there's no reason. The Buster Sword is a perfectly good weapon. I would have to look at the stats to know if it's actually better or worse. You know what's really funny? And I don't is... know the attack versus magic and stuff like that. And I like think that. it's something that, like, most people bring up. It's like, the, the Buster it's your first weapon, you use it, and then you find something better and immediately just throw it to the yeah. side. Yep. You just don't give a shit about it. Yeah. Mm. In, in game, it was. I assume that was a really difficult thing for them to deal with in this game, is that the Buster Sword is Cloud's iconic weapon. But even in the original game, I assume you dropped the Buster Sword in like yeah. 20 minutes. Like, immediately. So they had, to, they had to grapple with that for this game. Buster Sword is better in attack, though. Oh, this has, this has literally no... Uh, it's not a magic weapon at all. This has no material. It's magic. It's it's equal oh, magic, equal you can attack. Add, you can add some material, but yes, by default, it has some. I think you can add, like, two. Oh, God. Basically, that's why I was saying, just get the skill and get out and be done with it. Um, you, can, you can get it by going back through those monsters back in that area, the Toad King area. Um. Yeah, you actually you can add I think three unconnected slots right now. Sure hopes. Because I see another oh, I see it, another it, materia it, node. It's on, it's, I thought it was on the other ring and it's not on this one. Yeah no. Um. Oh sweet okay. But it is also still Ooh. like it is also still not a great weapon, uh, and I would not advise sticking with it for a long time. Oh, it has <laughs> luck up. What are you talking about? That's insane. I don't know what all luck does in this game. Not I mean, exactly. Probably. Not. I'm gonna do critical hit boost though. I always like critical hit chance, even though it doesn't fucking work. Um, there was one thing I did. I can't I, remember what it was. I will say this: this weapon is actually not the worst for something else we do need to do in this chapter, which I'm gonna have you do next. Um, I mean, really, this seems like a monster of a weapon because it has a bunch of critical rate stuff on it. Yeah, but as I said, it has a different attack pattern. Oh my god, this weapon could be nuts. Well, you do it. And then also after this, no, 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 you have to like, you have to play a really, really dangerous game with this weapon. You have to be. Is it a low health, high crit? Yes. Oh uh, yeah, I don't like low health strats. I don't ever, like ever. those strats, but sometimes never. they're like really good. I I despise them. <laughs> yeah. I never in any game where they're offered, I never do them. What game was it? Ooh, yeah. Okay. So yeah, this this is a no. luck. This is a luck. Um, or a crit-based build that you have to, like, be low health on to do. Yeah. Which, if you pair with, like, a bunch of HP materia, not that bad. You could, you could, there's, I imagine it would actually be probably really good yeah. in end game or in post game when you have a bunch of extra stuff. Yeah, when you have a bunch of, when you're not trying to, like, max shit out. When you already, yeah, when you can build anything exactly. Oh man, you we gotta to. go like. You need to go back to the kids. Way back for the other stuff. Too. Yes, you do. But right now, you need to go back into the kids' camp. Yep, yep, yep. Yeah, they have another um, quest for me. They do. They have a mini game, and it's actually super fun. I'm gonna go make, refill my drink though, real fast. So beer, beer. Oh yeah. Um. Yeah, probably so. Thunder, how are you, buddy? Chat. How is everybody else? How's everybody's week? I hope everybody's week was good. I traveled to New Orleans on Monday. I'm it's supposed to be rainy. I already don't like raining. I, or I already don't like flying. And we're going to fly into a thunderstorm. And I'm probably going to leave in a thunderstorm. And I'm just kind of... I'm a little uh, about it. You can finally play Whack-A-Box again. It's all thanks to you. Whack-A-Box? Oh, yeah, I forgot. There's this tired-looking guy out by the community center, and I heard he was looking for some help. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I do hear they have good food. I agree. Oh, hey, Cloud! You're just in time for our favorite game, Whack a Box. Whack a Box. It's super fun. I do want to play Whack a Box. The person who whacks the most boxes is crowned champion of the hideout. We usually don't let adults play, but since you're cool, we're going to make a special exception just for you. Well, thanks, dog. I have to get 30,000 for the target score. What? Oh, God. 
Oh no! Destroy as many boxes possible with a time limit. Each box will add to your score. The sum reaches the game is over. Reach the target score to win. The durability, effects, and score differ each type of box. Oh my god, it's like a run the gauntlet type of game. Here we go. Oh my lord. There we go. Holy jeez Louise, man. Oh, there's another 1500 one and another time box up there. I do unironically love this game. I think this mini game is super fun. How are you feeling about it? Uh, I'll feel better when I beat it. Yep. It's hard. Um, uh, it doesn't seem easy. Uh, you may... I think I did this with the nail bat, and I actually think it's okay. Uh, it actually seem, it seems pretty decent, to be honest. Uh, but you Let's should... Uh, you will need to get the high score. That's, that's the main thing. You actually need to get the high score. I just need to know, do I have to hit every single box, or is there plenty more? You do not need to hit every single box by any by any means. Here we go. Um, All right. Don't Michael, worry. I don't know if there was any context here. New Orleans does have food. Oh, you're going to New Orleans. That's right. Yeah. That's the context. Uh, I. Um, well, let's talk about how uh, I'm not. I'm not really thrilled about flying. I don't really care for it. And, you, you, uh, you don't like heights, and you've never been super keen on flying. And um, it's supposed to rain like every day I'm in New Orleans. Like I'm gonna be flying in with thunderstorms, basically. So here's the thing. On one hand, New Orleans and Louisiana, the one time I was there, it weather-wise is kind of a nightmare. I, I mean, on it's probably pretty hand, similar to like Florida. It's, it's a human. Oh, let's go! Let's go! That was amazing. Holy shit. That was really good. More time. I don't think you're getting the other time, though. That was cool as fuck. I don't know if you're going to get a high enough score. I think you're just barely short. What do you mean? What do you mean? I think you needed 35,000, and I think you got 30. You got 34. Oh, I thought it was only 30,000. Uh, well, I could be wrong. I could be wrong. Let's find out. Let's oh, find if out. it's 35, I'm going to be a little upset. <laughs> well, what do you think? Nope. It feels good to help people out, doesn't it? Yeah. Mm. No, it was 30. It was 30. Oh, thank check God. With, check with her. She'll show you before you go you in be afraid to show it your more. score or whatever. It's um, service and but yes. Uh, I'll leave that to you. All right. But don't think you can rely on me forever, mister. Wasn't planning to. That's good. Because I command a very good salary. All right, yeah, I'll talk to her again. Yeah. Want to play some Whack-A-Box? Yeah, Cloud's just a little mood boy. Um. Yeah, I got everything. Every little check mark. And good. And it tells you what prizes you won, too, because it all kind of flew yep, by. I got everything. Um. I don't know if any of those... I can't see it because it's behind the camera feeds. I don't oh. know if any of those prizes are worth getting. Spectral Cogwheel. I don't know what that does. I actually think I use that. I actually think that's a solid item. Is it? Yes. Um, check the effect, but I remember using this item through to the end game. Um, that was Weapons on a Rampage, right? Was that the name of that quest? That was Whack-A-Box. No, Weapons on a Rampage is what we're going to do. Oh, okay. Consuming MP fills the limit gate. That's insane yes. on Aerith. What? It, there you go. Yes, that's the thing. Whoa, that's nutty. Every time you spend MP, you just get some... Not like a ton, but like... It's still it, kind of bulking, though. She especially basically needs to fill her shit for doing whatever she does. Especially for Aerith, who wants to... If you want to use that refocus, you need to hit that limit gauge as soon as possible. You guys like this loading zone that they disguise in here as an open map? Right. <laughs> right. I don't um, like holly simulators. 
Was that one called a ver? What was that actually a side quest or was it just a game? It was a. I don't know. Okay, whatever. We can check the side. I have the list of side quests. We'll side quests. We'll check it later. Got the most um, variants. If you want to, I do. Oh, oh was that Battle Intel Six? Uh, maybe. Synergy material. What? Yes. Allows that's it. The one. An ally to follow the leader's attack command with an attack from linked. Does not consume ATB or MP. Works with fire, ice, white, and poison. So, Ooh. for example, you put that on Cloud. You play Aerith. Every time Aerith casts, Cloud will stop what he's doing to cast for free the, sp the one that you have linked to the synergy. Yo, Steadfast Block seems actually really good. Uh, mm -hmm. It's fine, and you already have one. It's really good. I look forward to receiving That's fine. All of your future battle intel First Strike is the one that I used a ton. Which all you right. should once you eventually have the slots for it. Oh, yeah. Um, fucking ball. All right, now we gotta go do the weapons one. So Maybe. I will say, if you one oh, wait, thing no, there's you... still one more quest, Angel of the Slums. Now it's the other doctor. You have four more quests. You have four more quests to do still, unless uh, you've already done weapons on a rampage. No, that's it's on my list, but it's not done yet. By my count, you have weapons on a rampage, a verified hero, the Angel of the Slums, and paying respects. Oh, Those Angel of the Slums right here. By this guy who has this wristband on. Yeah. By the way, you do still, at some point, you need to walk back to the church. Which is a long ways. You don't oh, have to take yeah, the rooftop. We have to go get, to go get the stuff again, don't we? You don't have to walk on the rooftops. There's actually just a road. I'll do that when I go do the weapons thing. Yeah, at some point you just need to walk all the way back there, grab the materia. It's not like a huge deal, but may as well. It'll take five minutes. On the contrary, my dear. Yeah. Press badge, basically. Of the plight of our undercity brethren. Of the plight of our undercity brethren. Shut your mouth. Now then, my friends, I find myself in need of your exceptional services for a trifling matter. Are you familiar with the mysterious and notorious bandit known as the Angel of the Slums? No. She delivers written declarations to her victims, usually Shinra associates, before... The Angel of the Slums is the one girl! Everyone hmm? knows her. Everything the she teacher. She gives to the poor and needy. Yes, she's got a knack for public relations. Very popular down here as a result. It's the, the lady who just helped with the kids. The the public order. I've made it my mission to <laughs> Now that my identity as a reporter has been exposed, my sources have all deserted me. Oh my god, that was very funny. The man who will serve up my scoop. Oh god. I just saw my head from the back in the camera. I'm so bald. You should just shave it. Go for the go for the bald look. Go no. for the full bald look. No, because shave... I don't even shave my face because it's too much work. That's <laughs> why I don't shave my face. I'm not going to shave my... I have to shave my head like every couple of days. I'm not going to shave my that. damn head. That's stupid. God, no way. I mean, you should, though. I think it'd look good. Ugh. Maybe someday, but... <laughs> Today is not that day. <laughs> oh, my God. I love this lady's design. Useful enough? The kids have been talking about you. The defender of a secret hideout. I'm assuming this is the hero verified one. Maybe not. She might do it. I am. <laughs> I'm a lover of the whispered word. Not that it's any real secret, mm -hmm. considering how chatty that Shinra Mutt's been. Who is that voice actor? I'm doing it for myself. Call it curiosity, whatever. Oh, could it be you've fallen under the angel's spell like so many others? Yeah, who's, the, who's the voice actress? I'm looking, I'm looking. It so looking. happens that I have some information for you. But I'll need a moment before I can give it to you. Susan Why don't you wait Silo? For that reporter of yours? Hmm. Doesn't ring any bells. She's been in some stuff. Where's um, she been in? Uh. On the Final Fantasy wiki, it mentions she is Wuya in Shaolin Showdown, Sartana of the Dead in El Tigre Adventures of Manny Rivera, Valerie in Tales of the Borderlands, Sandra Shore in Inhumanoids, and Yin in The Legend of Korra. Korra. But, like, Yin is not a major character. 
Hmm. Quickly before you have another, tell us. But let me look up about the notorious more. angel of the slums. Has she struck again? Is that it? I don't know anything about that, but I do know where her hideout is. Her base of operations? Now that's you thought Joe did shave his head? Nope. Tell me. He does not. Deep in the scrap. I'd look out for <laughs> This is all natural, baby. These days, it's the perfect place for a criminal to hold up. Look out. We cut it pretty short, but check it out right now. But before you go, I should warn you about this rumor I heard. You should have seen him like when we started high school. Oh yeah, Corbin's on Discord and he's probably never seen that photo before. I don't know if he has. Quite large. I share this every now and then because people are always shocked. Like right I'll, when he right when he started college. Well, I'll share the one from before college. Well, uh, well, a good reporter knows never to take foolish risks. The plan you first, don't recognize this voice actor. Every respectable journalist motto. The lady? You, you don't recognize her. Okay. <laughs> right Maybe she just sounds very similar to somebody else. She, she has not been so anyone important. Person. She's been in stuff. Okay, gotcha, gotcha. But like, not, not much. Okay, that's fine. She, just, she actually, oh, she, she has this very familiar vibe. That's true. Um. Okay, so both of these are farther out. And there is no fast travel. Where am I going to find this dang picture? All right, so we need to go back. So we need to do... So I tell you what. We're going to walk up to the church and then walk back down and All do right. the nuts and bolts and the... Yeah, wait, wait, sorry, hold on. What is the weapons of... I'm going to post... it. This weapons actually on a rampage isn't... and the um, angel I... of the slum. I don't think I've shared this picture before, this specific picture before. It's I just went to my Facebook and looked. This is a picture from high school, but not my senior year. I think it was my junior year. I don't know. Have I seen this picture? Oh. You probably have. It's not notable in any other way than being a picture. Oh, I've seen that picture a billion times. Oh, sure. Um, on, on the stream chat channel. Oh yeah, there's the origin of the Joe Pog. That picture. Oh God. yeah, the Joe Pog. I love that picture so much. I that picture gives me nightmares. Oh God, and the pictures from college when I weighed like fifty pounds less than I did because I was yeah. walking every single day. We were, we were walking eating, everywhere. And eating single people diets, which was like a grilled chicken breast. Every Not only days. single people, but broke ass diets because yeah. we were college kids and we didn't have any fucking money. Yeah. You know, we had we had to deal with that, and then we had to deal with yeah all that shit. And it's like, oh, okay, well, that's fine. And, I, it's and fine. I went through. I definitely my hair got shorter over a period of time. It was it was long, and then it was shorter, and then it was shorter, and then now it's we buzz it or not buzz it, but like we cut it really short, like every six weeks. Oh God, here's okay. Here's here's college. God, I hate these pictures so <laughs> much. I hate these pictures with a passion. I understand how you feel. <sighs> I don't know if I actually do. I was like fifty but, pounds but shorter. Like, I looked or fifty like pounds this. shorter, fifty pounds less than I am now, and was walking a lot more. I mean, sure, I'm probably eating better now than I was then, but... I think I'm eating better now, too. I just am also eating a bit more, and I'm... Like, I was... The problem is I was riding four miles on my bike five days a week. Right. On a real-ass bike, not an exercise bike. Right. And, we, and, and also, yeah, we were... Our meals were, like, nothing. Yeah. Um... But when we'd go out to eat as college kids, we'd find the place with the cheapest and get the most food. And you know, that kind of like has stuck in my head a little bit. It's like, if I don't get a certain portion, God, I fucking love that fire picture. <laughs> I love that fire picture I, more than you understand. I have to share that one. It's so good. Um, but like, I justify like food as a college kid still. And I don't think that's good to do. Because it's like, well, I could get, I could have gotten really good food and not a lot of it for a pretty high price but i don't need to eat like i was in college anymore i need to stop doing that yeah that's yeah that, it, between eating cheap and almost no just protein and carbs and nothing else 
Right, I um, get chakra materia. What else do I need in the in the church? That's literally it. Is it? Is that all? Yep. You will come back here in a later chapter for a side quest, but right now that's it. That's it. I didn't even need that chakra. I already had. I know. One. I know. But like, I'm trying to make sure you don't miss anything. And it took like five minutes of our time. <sighs> Whatever. So now we need to go. The oh, beer you makes go... it really foamy. You should be walking by that gate that you bought the key for. Or wait, did you do that already? I bought the graveyard gate key. Can you look? Do your side quest? Does it have a record of discoveries that you've done? Discoveries are technically different than side quests, but they might be in there. Um. Oh. 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 oh, oh. Yeah. Um. The one where you we came around and we had to unlock that one door. We've already done. Is that one called? I need you to actually look at the name. Is that one called "The Gate Won't Open"? I think it is. I think that's the one. I don't know. How would I find that out? I'm. I was asking you to check your quests menu, sir. <sighs> <laughs> then I have to figure out how to do all. That sounds dumb. All right. All right. Here we go. All right. I didn't know if discoveries were listed um, along with side quests. No. Okay. Then I will just look up. Discovery, the gate won't open, and we'll see what happens. Hold on, hold on. Yes, I have it. It's right here. It's in the story mode. It's in the story oh, check sure. mark rather than the quest check mark. And the discovery is It's done. been unlocked. And it was literally just that shortcut gate. Okay, cool. Then I will cross that off. I never asked for this. <laughs> That's, really, That's really funny. Oh, yeah, man. I mean, I knew every single man in my family is bald. Like, it's even even if it was, I know it's just my mother's don't father feel, that matters. Don't feel bad. Um, oh, I don't. I don't feel bad. I I have I oh. have learned to. You rock it, right? I I deal with what I have, and that means cutting my hair so, short. So the question what I'm embarrassed is, by was like my sophomore year when I definitely was going bald. I did not have the head to wear the hair I was wearing. And I was just keeping it long for the sake of it. The other thing is I'm just so sad that I had long hair for years and I never did anything with it. Because what I wish is I wish I had hair now that I could just like style in some way. Do something. <laughs> do with literally it. anything. Because I literally did nothing. I washed it with I three in one shampoo and conditioner. It's the only thing that I did. So um three in one? But is now that what I, you said? Yeah, like I'm just talking about the like the shit. Yeah, I know. It's That's just what very I. Funny. I just wish that I had hair now because it would be nice to, I don't know, just do something, get a haircut that's not just everything's the same length, get a haircut, and put some product in it, and that's the kind of thing I never did, and I wish that I did. All right, should I put? <laughs> Put in no, I like the beard look for Joe because uh, Joe oh, without a beard yeah. is no longer normal, and I don't like it. No, I definitely pro beard. Um, I'm not losing the beard anytime soon. Put synergy in there. Oh no! Well, you don't want synergy on Aerith. You want remember mm. synergy goes on the person you're not controlling. <sighs> Fine, you're right. Um, I would put first strike on Aerith because. It lets you start with ATB ready to go, so it means she can cast right at the beginning. So if you don't have first strike on anybody yet, that's what I would give to Fine, somebody. fine, fine. I also don't know if I want this refocus on it break on. Oh hey. The uh Um Steve and Alex amiibo are going to be released on my birthday. Corbin was around for Titus Beard? I think so. Were you really? Um, but yeah, Steve and Alex Amiibo, they, they certainly look like a Minecraft Amiibo. They're just the characters standing there. Oh, it was, is... it was like in February is when Master Duel dropped. Oh, what, let me do this. Oh right yeah, the, the Minecraft ones. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Let me look at my YouTube for a second. It's, it's like, yep, that's the, that's those characters standing yeah, there. Very just, very just But standing like, that's, there. that's what a Minecraft amiibo would look like but also xenoblade 3 icons for nintendo switch Ooh, um who do they have okay all well right, it's on, not on, the on. ones i would have picked but i will buy them all 
So Michael, if you're paying attention, yeah, you it was a it was a Yu-Gi-Oh video. I went from from Redeem. a uh, bearded boy to a clean-shaven man. Will be refreshed each week. I'm gonna be buying all of these icons. Oh, I see. Wave one is Noah and Mia. Wave <laughs> two is Uni and Tyon. Wave three is Lons and Senna. Wave four is Chibi. Is my meta video like? Do I have a fucking beard in my meta video? I do have a beard in my meta video. Holy shit. I don't look that bad with a beard. I'm gonna be honest. I'm gonna be honest. I like it. I do wear a hat much more than I used to. Um, because I used to have really long hair. Um, I used to have like really long curly hair, and I've always wanted to wear a hat because I think I don't look that bad in a hat. And so I'm gonna take this off so Joe can still I hear me. But I so, like, these little guys, when it's really humid outside, which is why I'm wearing my hat now, is. The, the, the curls that Thunder's talking about, these fucking idiots right here, go haywire when it's humid outside. And I can't stand it. And so I put them under a hat. My anime curls just kind of go ape shit. Sorry, I'm too focused on trying to redeem nintendo switch icons it's your look though it's true it is. the hat you've i've grown on the hat i i've got this i like that personally hat. don't We've got this. like the idea of wearing hats um Shit. like 24 7 i wear hats when i go outside because i'm bold and i don't want to sunburn on my scalp so i wear hats outside whenever i can remember now because i need to <laughs> um don't like i said don't forget to use clouds his triangle ability on multiple enemies you picture white, you, long hair me being like weird out? Oh man. When do they July? Um, it starts today. Shouldn't I be able to go get them? There's some on the Discord already, I'm pretty sure. If Thunder wants to link them again, basically. They're up, they're there. Oh yeah, yeah. They're like. Long haired Titus had gorgeous curly locks. And then I got annoyed with it. Now I really I need to go get a haircut. My hair, my hair, my hairline start. I mean, I'm I'm old. I'm going to be an older man. You know, I'm in my early early thirties, <laughs> which aka <laughs> thirty one, <laughs> and uh, my hairline's starting to Just recede. Really default to poster a smidge, <laughs> like a like a tiny bit, and so um, it annoys the shit out of me. Cause... Oh yeah, that picture. Good job. Good job, Thunder. No already... beard, skinny Joe. That was a very narrow time. That. I... Oh yeah, that was good. That I was like that. Oh god, no, not that picture. Oh, I love that picture. That's my favorite picture of me. Just period. Yes. Yes. It's not an edge lord. It's just a cool. It's my senior picture. No. It was a cool no. picture. Did, have I ever shown you my senior? My I have. You've definitely. Seen You're me. out of your mind. That is an amazing picture, Thunder. If you think that's an edge lord, <laughs> you were trying a little too hard in that picture. <laughs> Which one? Which one? The, the squatting one. No, it's so cool. It's a low water bridge. No, I all I know you're in a rustic area. It's, yeah. it's a scream senior photo. It is a senior photo! I know, but you can tell. <laughs> yeah! <laughs> I don't understand why I'm getting shit on for my senior photo. I got this. Uh, you got this. I got this. I'm simultaneously <laughs> trying to find photos of me, but also trying to find also Nintendo, trying to not Nintendo Switch icons. I guess I have to do it from my switch. I might have to go pull that from downstairs. Right, I need to Where win. is... I need to find my senior photo. Don't so, I actually had two batches of senior photos because the first batch was so bad. Did they you were... Really? They were, uh... Well, just, they were, like... They were done by, like, a friend of my mom's. And... They were, like, right. fine. Why don't you lead the but they were not... We needed photos that screamed senior photo. We needed some just more standard photos. And you're making fun of me, and now you're like, but they're... Oh, I'm going to show you this photo, and you're going to be like, excuse me. You're going to... I guess you'll remember it, but like, it's been a minute since you've seen this photo. Um, Here we go. You definitely have. There's no way you have it. Get him. But... How am I supposed to stagger these? Or I can stagger them. Oh, uh... I... 
Good luck. You already have most of the stagger effect stuff done, don't you? Well, I guess for this... Do you this... actually have any battle intel that's, like, still in progress, or did you finish No, it? I'm done with all of them, so okay. does it... You will, you will get more later, but, like... Is it... I don't know if you get stagger ones more later. Oh, I don't... Okay, okay. So I don't have to worry about it too much, then. Keep it together. No, you don't. Okay, that's what I was like. I was like, do they... Are they gonna keep stacking? Like, if I do it, is it gonna... Oh, all right, man. I'm posting this picture. Tagging out. I got this. Uh, so it's my turn? <laughs> I remember this picture. <laughs> it was at your mom's house. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> it's not good. I'm so sorry. No, it's really, it's really, it, it, it's quite bad. Um. It's shockingly not good. <laughs> it's very bad. That batch of senior photos. Okay. Is not great. Get him, get ready. Um. It was definitely, it, yeah, and, and to be clear, there's more, they're also not good. Really? Uh, yeah, okay, I, fuck it, all in, right? I mean, might as well at this point. What do you have to lose? I'm coming! I mean, the nice thing is it's, I'm far enough removed from these now that I'm not, I'm not the person in these photos anymore. You're holding a Rubik's Cube. Oh look! Oh look closely at all the details. You're holding a Rubik's cube. You have drumsticks, a bunch of books, your letters yeah, from no, band. Notice what the books are. Oh, this game is still going. Hold on, hold on, hold on. Feeling chilly? <laughs> okay, hold on, hold on. I have to break this fucking photo. Oh my god! <laughs> <laughs> That's the best fucking photo. That is literally the best fucking photo I've ever seen. <laughs> <laughs> oh my lord. Okay, so. Uh, this is gonna make a terrible VOD. I'm sorry. I Join the Discord. Join the Discord. You're gonna have a lot of fun. Yeah. Oh, man. Oh, God. Um, you have like a, a guide to reality book. You have a fucking like relativity. 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 Okay, I can't really see it because and of the black one is Hitchhiker's Guide to the Galaxy. Okay, it's really blurry when I'm trying to zoom in. And a calculus book. Fucking amazing. Oh um, this is me. I'm the smart nerdy guy who gets made fun of every day. Yeah, it was like it was like the the the, the problem was the person who was making fun of was like. He's like, I want to incorporate your hobbies into the senior photos. And so what are your hobbies? I'm like, well, I'm a nerd and I'm in band. And he, it was just like clear he didn't know what to do with that. So he was like, get a bunch of nerdy stuff. And it wasn't like it was judgmental. He just did not. No, he just to, didn't know what to do. He did not know how to present that information oh in a God. way. I have to pee from these beers. You have to vamp. Uh, oh, my I Lord. I have done enough, I think. Oh, I think shit, I've done so enough good. for this stream. <laughs> Showing these photos off. Um... <laughs> Uh, yeah, let's see, do I have any other, is there any other gold on Facebook here? Um, and to be clear, those are the worst ones. There's some perfectly reasonable and acceptable photos on, like, there are totally reasonable photos from that shoot that are just, like, me, you know, like, well lit and a regular photo. I did not look great, but the photo was fine. Um, but like, yeah, yeah, there were, uh, I, ooh, I do have pictures of baby Joe. You can come in with me, come on. Good dog. Let's see, let's see here. Ah, babies. Where is a good... Oh, here's, we can do, <sighs> here's a picture of Joe Pog if you predate Joe Pog. Yeah, that's pretty good. My doggies decided to join me. God, that picture's so good. It's so good. Oh, and now you guys want out? You were so happy to be in here. Hey. This is this is great for a VOD. You should just join the... <laughs> this is your fault for not joining the podcast. Uh, but, uh... All right, yes. now we gotta do the, um... Uh. Other one. Oh, there's a bunch of these, like, weapons on a rampage. There's just some random spots. Is that how it goes? They're just in random areas? Okay. Oh, Thunder didn't even know that? <laughs> know what? Where the Joe Pug came from. Oh! No, he didn't know that. I thought it was him that did it. It was Kitty that did it. God, 
Kitty's a fucking master. I know. It's it's. <laughs> I love it so much. God, she's so fucking. If good. anything, it needs to be clipped because the mouth doesn't quite show in the it, icon. If yeah, anything, it, it needs to be clipped a little bit. Just a teensy bit to show the mouth more. But like, yeah, no, that's where that comes from. Very good. From like 1996 or whatever that was. <laughs> whatever. You should have perms for emotes. Okay, okay. I'm shocked he doesn't. You should. He I know should. Thundir would do good work. He's the M he's the emo MVP. All right, hold up. You're not gonna finish these fucking quests in no, this space. No, we're not. <laughs> no, we're uh, we'll get there. We'll get there. But like, but like at the same. Oh, my fucking streamer. I don't give a shit about. This. Let's uh look at. Um, this will be quick. Promise. Maybe. Hmm. Rolls. This one. Allow view uh, permissions. Um, manage emo emojis and stickers. Save. Done. All right, there you go, sir. You now have. You now. <laughs> I forgot we had a down. We did it like on our. We did it ironically, right? It was like a thing. Was it Pixie? No, it wasn't. It might not have been Pixie. It was we did something, and it's like, oh, we have to dab now. And I'm like, I guess I fucking do, huh? That one of these days we're gonna get to. I've had it. I've had this one tier list idea. We haven't done a tier list in ages. We haven't. And I have the the best idea I've ever had for a tier list, and we're just sitting on it because I haven't had a good chance for it. This game, we talk too much. We have to talk too much about the game. Mm -hmm. Um, I have to hit two enemies with that fucking move? You have to hit multiple enemies with your triangle, Dude, which is a slow-ass move so with no slow. range. So slow! Because it says I either know. with that or a strong attack. How the fuck am I supposed to do that? Wait, we did the Apocalypse tier list, right? Uh, yeah, we did. I never deleted that. We did, we did. I'll just, yeah, I... Anyways. <laughs> that's old, man. That was <laughs> fat. That picture, holy shit. That is an old picture. Okay, all right. You're on your way back to the town, right? Or are you in the town? What are you doing right now? I have no idea. What I gotta fight this stupid idiot. That's a big bitch. This is gonna be hard, isn't it? Oh, uh, the main thing is do your assess. It has a body part, and you need to just cast a lot. Yeah. You'll read it as soon as you. Is this the graveyard? No, oh, this is the Angel of the Slums. Okay. Just make sure you do the assess and just uh, be oh, careful. Oh, Clown has assess. I keep fucking trying to do... Uh, Let's use the thunder on the ball. Uh, you'll learn. Yeah, I figured that's, that's, that's what it what was. Yeah. Use the thunder on the ball, specifically. And Aerith can use whatever magic she wants. Ow, holy lord. Mackerel. <laughs> Yeah, this is a single enemy, so you also can't work on your proficiency. Nope. The best part, though, is if we finish this chapter, we will get to my favorite music in the game. <laughs> we just have to finish this damn chapter. Go on. Don't overdo it. Come on, you can do but yeah, it. do the. You can ass you can assess if you want, but yeah, that's that's the. Back to good now. I need to heal. Well, sure. I got your number. He has a lot of HP. Holy. It is. It is worth noting, with the arcane ward out, you probably should be using cure twice instead of cure. Because cure is double cure is way overkill. I mean, even she was in the red. I wanted her. I wanted overkill. Well, I know, but it was. She heals a lot. Let's do this. Bro. The ball, yeah, the ball instantly to, like rebound you. It's this fight is annoying. Let's get this one. This one's for you. Okay. Oh, oh. I went away. Well, yeah, okay. Oh, I'm silenced. Crap. Not your triangles. It's the... It's, the, it's, it's not, my strong attack. It's your... Yeah, it's whatever it's called. It's called, like, uh... 
it has an item. Right? Is it a Punisher? Yeah, the Punisher mode, this move? No, not Punisher mode. Disorder. Disorder is what you need to hit multiple people with. Oh god, that move is bad and actually, too. It seems like you actually, I saw the proficiency gained text. I think by hitting both the ball and the body, it counted. Really? So you might actually be able to spam it out in this fight and just get it. Well, we're gonna try. I mean, you may as well give it a shot if you see the proficiency text. All right. Oh God, I might have to do it when he's staggered though. Yeah, because you bounce off the ball. You either need to make sure you hit the body before the ball, or you have to, yeah, or you just have to make sure he's staggered, because then you don't bounce off, I don't think. Um. Or can I only get proficiency once in a fight? No, you can get it multiple times in a fight. For Ow. sure you can. After you. Ow. Oof. Oof, hey, indeed. Sorry, but oh my goodness, what else is going on today? Um, I don't know, man. It's been... It was the last day that I will have to see my engineer that is leaving. Oh, yeah. Is, yep. Because he's he's taking tomorrow off to help move his family into a new apartment, and then he's, I'm sure. he's leaving... Um, while you're gone? While I'm gone. Oh, I already learned it. Let's go. Oh my god, I don't Perfect. have to use this freaking uh, this <laughs> stupid thing anymore. Holy crap. This order is actually not a bad skill. Uh, yeah. But yeah. this fight is annoying because he just has these like... It's mostly the deflect. It's no, it's these uh... Mm. Freaking... The like clouds or whatever. Clouds are really... <laughs> oh lord, that hurt a lot. Ugh. Man, yeah. Aerith has a lot of MP though. Oh, it's because you've been casting you've been casting Thunder, but you haven't really been casting with Aerith. Right, because she much. doesn't have Thunder. Yeah. Just a little should help. Oh, that didn't even fully heal. With double cure? Nope. Wow. Stay strong, okay? Oh my god, that was kind of a problem. Huh? You almost have your limit breaks though on both characters. Be careful. Oof. Oh, oh you didn't give her the auto life. Oh well. She maintains her limit gauge. Nice. And it probably resets aggro. It's your turn. God, that is super annoying. Oh, your ward did go away though. No more mining I think when she I think when Aerith died, she dropped her ward. Finally. Hello, Orion. I know. I know. Good boy. Uh, yeah, let's try and get some more damage in. Aerith, why did you just take that attack head on? <laughs> like, girly, please, do better. I'm out of, um, MP. I mean, you have ethers. I'm gonna you have, have to. You have, you have plenty of them, so... Gonna have to keep it together. I'll take care of them. Oh, and you'll and you you're gonna start getting turbo either soon, like on a regular basis. So this. Can you take over? No, 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 no. Attack that guy, please. All right, let's heal, Aerith. Gotta heal first. Why don't you Cloud, why are you just standing there like a big freaking idiot? The AI in this game is. I thought you, you said it was good. Calling uh, I mean, they they don't they guard a lot, which is good. Is it, Kinda seems ass. Deal with that. Here goes. Right. I'm gonna, I didn't kill it. it. It's on its like last little leg. Oh here. yeah, I was about to say like that shit. That shit. I want my money back too. <laughs> Kitty, we were just talking about you actually. We were reminiscing about olden days, you know. Oh, I need this key card, huh? Mm -hmm. Almost left. The calling card. The angel of the slums. We'll collect your offering on behalf from the angel of the slums. This must be one of her calling cards. I don't see anything else interesting. 
Let's head back and tell him what we found. I do not want to return to the porter because I still have another goal to do while I'm here. We're gonna kill two birds with one stone. Yep, absolutely. What are you doing now? I gotta What's find. I gotta find the. Um... It's not an lord. I'm sorry. I it is. Know. It's not. You're wrong. <laughs> you can stop killing Anjanath. Good, good job, Blah. I know the feeling. I will say, I was just thinking the other day. I don't. I'm not gonna suddenly pick up Rise. I certainly don't have the time for it right oh, now. Oh, so good. But I do think I might finally be getting the the right kind of energy to be oh. ready for the next Monster Hunter game. Oh, kitty, why do you hurt me like this? <laughs> I mean, it really. It's fair. And it's that's not! The, it really is. I'm not! I'm very upset by this. I love that picture. I think that picture is a it's great a, senior picture. It is a good picture with a very specific vibe. And there's nothing wrong with that vibe. But that's the but that's the vibe. And you're just gonna have to be okay with that. Um I don't know where you're supposed to go, by the way. Will you look it up, to be honest? What are you? What is this? Is this weapons on a rampage? Yeah, it's these. You need to I find have to these find like, the little ball guys that are attacking. They're in, they're in these, like, little pits. I know one of them is in this little, like... I fought one already. I fought one series already. But I don't know where the other ones there's are. Like a, there's, like, a, a, a lowered little, like, concrete pit, if that makes sense. So look for, like, a rectangle dead end on your on your map. <laughs> Edgelord turned ooh. ooh. Oh my. Guys, we've been we've been playing this game. We already did that the the like the one in the pit. Okay. Who has what are you talking? About? Um uh Thundier. Thundier, Thundier has... post he posted a selfie one. Oh day. yeah, like a while back. That was yeah. a while back. You're talking about this place, right? This this pit. I've already fought uh, them in this pit. This is where I first fought them. That is no, that's not the one. There's one that's like a concrete pit. Oh, okay. okay. There's another. There's like three spots, but um, F seven R weapons on a rampage. You ditched the curls. Why? That's a shame. Because you had to go to work. Like a normal fucking adult. And hate yourself. Can I find somewhere that shows? Okay, here we go. Um, look at your map. Excuse There's me. a whole. The weapons on a rampage circle is a large green circle that centers on a bunch of like interconnected paths. And in the in the top now. northwest corner of that circle, there's it. There's a dead end. That is the first one you should go. God, that. Oh, Sorcerer Storm. That move is crazy. I don't think so. It's very good. I do think. I keep my distance well, I don't know. It's really good for farming friggin' AP real quick. It's just go in, first strike, kill, get out. That's true. Oh, excuse me. Um. So, Thunder, are they giving you like a. Like a part-time job for, with your internship while you finish your school? That'd be pretty cool. Try it with our sweet oh, my dog's here, my wife. And my but yeah, are you bark. are you in the right spot? I can't tell because your map's behind uh, us. Uh, I'm getting there. My heel. Yeah, like I said, of the green circle, there's like this whole dead end path explicitly on it that basically is the northwest. Um. It's a circle, so the northwest compass direction. It's like exactly that angle. And there's like a thing right. Well, um, it looks like there's only two spots, so that might. Okay, be so the we're just trying spot. to find this one. 
It might just be the two. At least that's what this picture seems to imply. You might be negotiating a thing for next. Oh, that's cool though. At least, hey, money while you go to school is kind of nice. I yeah, know it's like any, a little bit extra stress, do, but any job you can do while you're in college is fantastic. And it's good I, experience. It's hard, but I do think it's important to do at least part-time work while you're in college, and ideally a little Let's bit go. high school too. I think it's important. I think it's good. Um, not not everybody can do it. Some people have to do it. But broadly speaking, I think it's I think it's solid. Sorcerer Storm might actually be really good on those guys. Yeah, I'm gonna try to be honest. But they might be like immune to magic or some shit. So. No, they're immune to physical attacks until you hit them with magic. Yeah, they're weird. Oh, you I... know what I didn't do though? Unequip this fucking bat. <laughs> oh yeah. Yeah, I were I had. Two different jobs while I was in college and a job while I was in high school. I guess I didn't have two jobs at the same time. I had two jobs in sequence in college. I did administrative work, work for my math department, and then I did, um, and then I taught a class. Yeah, the administrative uh, work was pretty easy. It was very easy. I, it was the most laid back thing ever. I barely did anything. It felt like I was stealing money from the math department. Um, but. And it was like, and I was working like maybe 10 to 15 hours a week, but it was income and that's what I needed. Just literally like a couple hundred bucks a week or whatever it was that I was making. Yeah. Like a hundred, I, if I was working like 10 or 15 hours, I was probably making $150 a week. Um, that alone was super, super nice to have in college. What? Um, just a few hundred dollars. You're making $150 a week? At 10 hours a week. At, at 750? Like, you know, you're probably right. Maybe it's $150 every two weeks. That sounds better. After taxes and stuff or whatever. I was it like, was not. That math doesn't not, check out. <laughs> unless I was working 20 hours. I don't think I ever got up to 20 hours. I think I worked like 15 or maybe. I don't know, whatever. Um, oh shit, you came out of the ground. Yeah, it was, it was fine. Like I said, I, I made some. I did very basic stuff. It was like printing packets for prospective students, okay, doing a little bit of database maintenance. I learned about Microsoft Access. Thank you. Mm. Uh, stuff like that. Um, and from that same point, it was fine. Like, I, I got some experience. Uh, I worked with some interesting people, and it was a different kind of job. It was the first time I had a job that was more even at a desk as opposed to being a cashier, so Sorry. that was nice. God damn it, that's it. That's it. I did that job for exactly, like... Eight months or something like that. Like I did that job for so less than turn? a year, and uh, um, uh, I I can say I basically didn't enjoy it at all. Yeah, that I mean, Thundir, I think that's a good amount of responsibility and work to be done in college, basically. You make roughly one hundred fifty dollars every two weeks or something. Yeah. Wait, right now you do Thundir? I thought it was a full time internship for you. I thought that was the library stuff. But oh, yeah, is that your library stuff? Yeah. I, I need I need clarification. Yeah, yeah, the library thing. Yeah, the yeah. library. Game. Oh, okay. Yeah, that seems right. Yeah, that seems fine. That's like what my wife God, I'd love to work at a library. Fucking quit everything, just work at a library. <laughs> Not that I've been to a library in years, but, you know, whatever. Yeah. yeah. Like you fucking would have... <laughs> Um, let's do the synergy material. Yeah, synergy and then, um, either, the only thing is do either fire or thunder. I was doing poison. Oh, poison also works. You just don't want it on blizzard because blizzard can miss. So like, mm. why are you going to have him interrupt a spell that can miss a bunch? Lightning is almost maxed. No, I, if, believe, Thunder, if I could work full time for a library and make the money I'd make now or like could never. live the could live the lifestyle i live now literally I would, never i would work for a lot i would work for a library in a heartbeat from the reactor getting lost in the slums the thought they were protecting the reactor and figured i was trespassing on their turf or something maybe almost feel sorry for getting all lost and confused okay. like that oh, there's like two things going on because there's machine this and then there's this other announcer thing going on on the side, and it's weird. Anyway, I think oh, yeah, yeah. Our work here is finished. 
If you're ever in the market for a merc again, remember, you can Why do these girl why are these girls pimping me out? Tifa pimped me out, now Aerith is pimping me out. I'm really glad you were willing to help out though. Thanks again. Actually, while you're here, I got another favor to ask. Your lip flaps are weird. His some of these NPCs are really bad. Uh, lip sync. Yeah, his his are not good. D don't know what that's about. The the Leaf House lady also was pretty bad. There's a guy up by the shop who has stuff for you. You must be that. The weapons on my face is done. Problem. It's the anniversary of my wife's death, and I wanted to visit her grave. But I can't because some creatures have turned the graveyard into their nest. Could you do me a favor and go there in my stead? She shouldn't be alone today. It'll cost you. That's fine, that's fine. The graveyard's right by the head of the river. But I heard they put a new gate in yes. recently to replace okay, this the is... We had to have paying... the graveyard. Now that this is paying respects. Moved, I'm sure it's locked up tight. Didn't we buy a graveyard key off Moggy? I think Do you did. have a quest called a verified hero? <sighs> That's the last quest. You already have Angel of the Slums you just need to go turn in, I think. I think yep. you're done with it. And then Pain Respects is after this one. Is this but one? Then, yeah, but I don't know if you have a verified hero, and I don't know what that one is. I do not have it right now. But I might get it after I turn in another quest. Yeah, I'll, I'll look at it real fast. This, right, this quest. This quest. I can't believe it. You found one of her calling cards. This is the genuine article. I'm sure of it. Pinned by the Wait. angel herself. Verified hero is just the ah, box mini game. So this mm. is one of Check your check your side quest list. It probably is just done. It's an incredible find. Oh, was that all? We only have one more to do. Looks like yeah. there's something else. A message. Well, hi Kiara. Are you, you, you telling everybody still around? around I was planning to teach you a lesson you would never forget. However, by the grace of the dog is singing apparently. Friend, you were spared that lesson. But next time you <laughs> might not be around to save you. You would be wise to watch your step. Okay, 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 okay. okay, okay. A warning. Yeah. Yeah. If the murder hadn't bailed you out, that fiend in the scrap would have ripped you to shreds. Sorry about that, friend. Here I was, just trying to help you out. But instead, my kindness almost got you violently killed. Now, now. No harm, no foul, right? In any case, I hope this narrowly averted tragedy won't discourage you from sharing information with me in the future. Hey, everybody! The angel left another calling card! She's gonna rip off Don Corneo! It's about damn time! Don Corneo! I can't wait to see how this goes down. Excuse me, I'm a reporter for the Daily Buzz and... So much for my reward. Here, why don't you take this? Oh, and no need to thank me. Let's just say it slipped out of that reporter's pocket. <laughs> <laughs> can't call it theft if you're just claiming what you're owed. Am I right? I would agree with that. Well done, Mr. Merck. You certainly lived up to your reputation. Okay. Um. I wish I could have helped what did I get? Because I didn't see it. Because I looked over at you for a second. Two thousand gil. Thank you. Did you have you figured out who the angel of the slums is yet? Uh, I'm assuming it's either her or the lady who runs the um. The leaf house. The leaf house. Okay. Okay. All right. One of those two. It's probably Le it's the leaf house girl because that lady didn't move. But she had something important to go do. I'm I'm not gonna tell you shit. I just was curious. Your silence says everything. <laughs> except for the uh except for the like four times I've explicitly faked you out. <laughs> I don't fucking um, know. That's okay, my guess. So... But... Wing. so you need to go do paying respects and yep. is that it? Yep, that's all. Because Angel of the Slums is done. Yep. And we, for my own sanity, we just confirmed that a verified hero is marked as complete in your quest log. Oh my god. I, you just need to show me that yes. it's complete. It is complete. This is what I deal with, chat. You should have seven quests complete right now. Oh yeah, this door. Oh, this is a boss arena. 
Look at took a bench. Ah oh, shit. Why don't you lead the way? Let me do this. Yeah, use that bench. Ow. Oh no, set. Well. Allow me. Oh, uh, those guys are tough. Oh. I'm coming. Oh. Oh, it no, is no, only no, six no, quests. No, no, no. I thought it was eight quests, but it's chapter eight. There are six quests. And two discoveries. One of which we've already done. And one of which we believe. I'm poisoned. How dare you? You stupid bitch. Venomantis. Uh, they have a proboscis that I have not noticed before, and uh, I don't like it. You don't like it? Is that what you yeah. said? Yeah, look at their proboscis and tell me that uh, you're not upset. Oh shit, that thing stopped my move. Dick. Yeah. I don't mind the scorpion tail, I don't mind the claws, but I mind that proboscis. Most of the people are like, what's the proboscis? I mean, most of the people uh, need to get educated. <laughs> It's the it's the it's the bloody sucky bit. Let's do this. It's the mosquito nose. Yes. It's the gross little dick nose thing that got hanging the, off of their face. It's the the bloody slurpy straw. The slurpy straw. What a fucking name that is. Oh shit. Sure. However I can help. Um. Well, you can be healed up, buddy. Oh, that does not put them to full. Keep it up. Also, it doesn't cast it twice for some reason. Go on. I'm trying, but. Oh, that hurt. I, can't. I think healing spells might get doubled instead of cast twice. Get up. Like maybe they. I'm I'm un I'm unsure about that as well. The other Go ones on. explicitly show you doing two different animations, but the healing ones don't. I don't know if they double or if they actually just... Or if we go read the flavor text of Arcane Ward that it tells you that it doesn't affect healing skills, which is entirely plausible. Um... That said, uh, you have very little left yet in this chapter, which is really exciting. So we're definitely going to get into chapter 9, which I'm super stoked for. Chapter 9 is a lot of fun. Hell yeah, got him. It, it, that said, it is another side quest uh, chapter. Hey, you want to say a prayer too? No thanks. I think you've got it covered. Return the old man. All right. And then we uh, go fight Rude, don't we? Because a um, man shows up to his to her house. Ooh, we're hurting. I'm yeah, really you need to. What you did. You finish. You this need to turn report. in paying respects. I owe him a lot. Yep. Maybe more than I can um, ever repay. And now I owe you a lot too. I know it's not much, but I hope it makes up for it a little bit. We that NPC is ripped, by the way. Yeah, but his face is stupid, so we hate it. His face is stupid, but he pulls off that tank top well. I can't tell you how much it was weighing on my mind. I was beginning to think I might never be able to visit her grave again. With my bad back and my legs, my whole body's a mess, frankly. I... I didn't think I could make it past the creatures. Okay. But I prepared to die trying. And then you two came along. Still, I've got the to face body's facts. a mess, frankly. I relate. No, I feel that, dude. Keep making these trips. It's all downhill from 26. Dude, this is the great when you hit 30, your body just gives up on you. It's 20. It's I downhill from 26. That's legs. what I'm telling you. Why don't you just give it back? Okay. It'll cost you 5,000 gil, though. 5,000? It's always money with you people. <laughs> Fine. I won't ask you for anything else. I'll take your damned key and give it to the boy. Uh, it's downright depressing. What is the world what? coming to these days? They're mad that I gave him the key? 
We probably ought to call it a day. Oh yeah, she's telling me all of my stuff is done. You've been working so hard, you lost track yes, of time. Yes, she makes that very clear. You. The pay sucked. Because they didn't know if you were worth it yet. But now they do. Come on, let's go home. Alright, time to go home. And they healed me, what nice guys. They spray their healing magic all over me. Hot. Uh, yeah, basically, they, that old guy gets mad at you because you're like, fucking go pay your respects yourself, you coward. Yeah, go take and this. And he's like, oh, hey, look, it's rude. We're going to go fight in this small out offshoot area over here. Yep. Why you got to be so rude, dog? Huh? Yeah, do the little glasses thing, you stupid bitch. Rude has a good theme, though. What do you want? Haven't seen him before. He your new boy toy? He's my bodyguard, if you must know. Wait a minute. Those eyes. Is he the one who beat up Reno? And Maybe. what if I am? Bro, Cloud just stepping up like a boss. Need to cross my T's, dot my eyes. That's all. Please, let's step into this arena. Cloud, leave him be. Rude's not a bad person, really. No, I I'm like Reno bad. more than Rude, but, like but I not, do like Rude. I sometimes have to do bad things. The Turks are weird. I'm not sure what the fuck the deal is with the Turks. Correct. <laughs> Nobody fucking does. Don't take it personal. Woo! He kicked me. Yes. I do like that he's a brawler. You Turks are all the same. All bark, no bite. You did switch back to the Buster Sword. Yeah, it has more attack. I didn't realize that. It has more attack. No need to can't keep eyes open. I got this. Do you know the name of the third Turk that we see in this game? There is a third Turk? There is a third one you see in this game, yes. I just know these two. The other one is named Sung. Uh, is that new? I, I, I don't know. His name is Sung. Wind attacks rapidly fill his stagger. Okay. Root is tough. He's he does. It's really hard to stagger him. He just like deals with his shit. Try using it. Can you take over for me? But yeah, I like that he's a brawler. I think that's cool. Come on. All right, look here, you big bitch. <laughs> you just fucking cast it on Cloud. No, I want to, because he has oh, the wind. Oh, okay. Oh, I didn't know he had wind. You have you do have Aurora if you need it. First class. So it's my turn. You all, I will say, next chapter you get a new <laughs> weapon for Cloud that will probably be your weapon till the end of the game. My guess is correct. Whoa. I don't know if you saw that. He grabbed Aerith's staff. Yeah, he did. Like, he had a dedicated animation just to grab her staff and knock her down to the ground. Keep it up. Right. That's My super turn. cool that he had a character. How how do they, for Square to fuck up so often and then that, them to have Dude, shit like that. I'm telling what's you. What's happening? I'm telling you, Square is the best bad company that there is. So like, that's, that's... Or they're the worst good company. One of the two. I don't believe that I have. You fucked up my fucking cast for my. Um, I love that he has backup blasts. Yeah, yeah, yeah. He does in the movie too. And think about changing colors. Oh, he's in the movie. Uh. Yeah. Um, oh, if if it helps you remember what he looks like, Sung at least in this game, he's like he's like a middling height Never to again. short Asian man with long hair and he has a he has a dot on his forehead. Well yeah, of course Square Enix cares about this project because this project prints them money. I'm waiting. But yeah, just something about the fact that they had a character specific animation in mid combat that looked really good and which like for an action game that runs really fast, the fact that he's able to then connect that animation in a way that looks really good is what's crazy to me. Oh shit, that hurt. Now you're in for it. Oh, that hurt. 
she didn't want to get rough. No, but this is keep Oh, going. shit. Oh, that's fine. That's fine, that's fine, that's fine. Um... Yeah, we'll probably just go ahead and do this. Bring it. That hit. You know. Ow. Okay. In with this. Ow. I figured you were in a game. I was just. It's fine. Oh, you bitch! You dirty, dirty, dirty bitch! There. Oh, he grabbed me and started kicking the shit out of me. I'll take care of him. He's throwing me around like a rag doll. This guy is being a real mick asshole. <laughs> mick asshole, that's great. Okay, all right. I'm getting real annoyed. That's just how fucking fight is almost done too. I know, but I can't. Just... He won't let off of me, so I can have freaking like cast your, one move. That's all I need to do is cast like a single freaking move, but he won't calm oh down God, for two seconds. Threw you around too. Where is... Oh my, god. oh my god, that fucking so cost me. I'd keep my distance if I were you. Snowblade Chronicles 3 icons. Buy them all. Gimme, give gimme, give gimme, give gimme all of them. Get fired up. I'm trying, but... Hey. Let's finish this. Alright, bro. Get fucking dicked on. <laughs> Me Just next. leave what? us alone. You know I can't do that. What the fuck? Why is he glitching out? Because I hit him with a I killed him with the first slash of the cross slash. So it finished oh, the animation in engine. Funny. Oh my god, his ringtone is the da 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 that's one. I'm sure you're having the time of your life, but we're needed on standby for a job as something about sector seven. So get your ass back here now. Understood. Gotta go back to Sector 7. Somewhere else to be? Apparently so. Hmm. Well, hey, we have the title. We got him. We got there. You were worried. We still have like an hour. Like 45 minutes. I know. We're going to get to my favorite uh, track of the game, which I'm not sure you've heard yet. And it's by far my favorite. So what amo what amoebas are after Steve and it's not Pyra and Mithra, is it? That's okay. one more. Yeah. No. It's not the arms character either. That's four of them. Mm -hmm. Is it Pyra and Mithra? I think there's one more. It might be Sephiroth. Oh that I'm gonna need. I'm gonna need Sephiroth. I'm gonna need it, it is Pyra. Sephiroth. I'm gonna need Sephiroth, Pyra, and Mithra, and Sora. I'm gonna need DLC all pack of them. two was Min Min, Steve and Alex, Sephiroth, Pyra, Mithra, Kazuya, Wait a sec. Sora. Oh yeah, Kazuya. I forgot about him. So yes, Sephiroth mm. next, mm. then Pyra. We'll Mithra. need that. Are you coming? Oh, the new um discovery the language. The discovery is what I was like why you needed to do all the quests. You don't get the discovery without... You don't oh get the God. discovery I'm without in, doing all the quests. I'm in, like, slow speed walk lock, though. Thank you. Nope, nope. Back to slow. Oh, hey, look, there's a materia back there. Yes, this materia, they show you explicitly during the discovery. Uh, you talking to the... So, yeah, it was that kind of day. By the way, this theme gets copyright claimed immediately. Eris theme gets copyright claimed like in an instant. Let's go. 
Shouldn't keep mom waiting. Hey, what'd they say? Good work today, guys. Kidding. They didn't say a word. But, you know... Uh, never mind. It's not like you'd believe me after all. They're having a moment. That's Probably cute. Not. Tell me anyway. Really? Yeah. He's so edgy. It won't be much longer now. The flowers, they... They have something important to tell us. Something they need to share with us. At least, that's the feeling I get. But before they can, there's a final step that has to be taken. You have to die. Otherwise, we won't hear them. Maybe I should just give up. Honestly, it's what I do best. Could have fooled me. From what I've seen, you're no quitter. Well, today's special. That's why I've been working my butt off. Uh, what's so special about it? <laughs> okay, time to go. You didn't answer the question. What is so special about it, Aerith? Learn to talk to her. Did Learn. the flower say anything? Learn to talk. Uh, good work today, guys? <laughs> That's the spirit. She's awfully cute. Right, what's this material? Is this any good? MP up. That's pretty good. Alright. Next. Bum, 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 Here we go. You're heading in already? Are we good to return to Aerith's house? Not listening to me. I'm sorry. I'm trying to see if... If Jaden can make a... You have done all the quests and you did the discovery. You are good to return to Aerith's house. And you got an MP up materia and did the discovery called the legend... The... Uh, uh, language of flowers. Yeah, that's enough for one day. Where have you two been? Uh, I've been worried sick. Sorry, we got a little sidetracked. Yeah. Dinner's ready, in case you're wondering. Ah, great. But before we sit down, I want you to make up the guest room. Gotcha. Take a load off, okay? Judging by those eyes, I'm guessing he's a loud boy. He is playing herbs right now. That's he's having fun with his friends. I hate to ask, but would you leave tonight without any fuss? No questions. You boys made a trade <laughs> a normal life. For power. You can't have it both ways. I'm back. Good. Now, I hope you're hungry. Starving, right? Uh. How old is Aerith? She's like 18, right? Ish. I think she's like 17 I've in the games canonically. So proud. The man you've become? Women must be hounding you day and night. Not really. You know, there's all kinds of temptations in the big city. I'd feel a lot better. You if look like a female clown. One who'd make sure you didn't get into trouble. I love Claudia. I think she's cool. I can take care of myself. An older, more mature girl. I could keep you on the straight and narrow and tell you when you're being a silly goose. A silly goose. That's the perfect type for you, I'd say. So, Tifa. Oh, 
22? Thanks. Perfect. That's what I needed. What about Tifa? Don't want to overstay my welcome. Aerith with my party. <laughs> Did you say no? I'm sitting in the house without letting Aerith spot you. Be careful not to bump into anything by accident. Aerith will notice you. Mate to her. And I get a little secret like thing to tell me to go back to bed. Oh. Shit. What are you doing? Uh, uh, nothing. There's a treasure chest in your room. I need it. Don't worry. You'll feel much better in the morning. And I promise to take you straight home. Uh. Okay. It is like, am I supposed to get out of this? Well, like immediately when I walked forward. Please don't let her hear me again. Oh, okay. Alright, let's look around. Little mini game. We can't run into any. The fucking buckets right in front of us. They want you to. Run. Yes, yes, they do. Alright. This. So, so, walking away. You're leaving. So, how do I get to Sector Seven? It's simple enough. Just cut through Sector Six. It isn't exactly safe, but you should be okay, seeing as you're a soldier. Was one. Promise me, you'll never talk to Aerith again. Please. You got it. Thank you. Well, why are you being such a bitch? I'm sorry. You're not obviously a bitch. Talk to her. I did say I did talk to her. She said I'm sorry. Well, she said. I'm sorry. Why did I say Claudia? It's Elmira. Well, Claudia was in the um, cutscene. I don't know who Claudia is in retrospect. Look like a cloud. All right. Well, go. Time to leave, and then have Aerith interrupt us from leaving. No, you do. Right. You do just need to leave, though. That is. Beep, 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 you already beep, turned beep, in beep. your battle intel. You're good to go. Just leave. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Eric's gonna be standing there like, "What you doing?" Uh, five points to anyone who gets that reference. I tried that new chocobo. chocobo? Here we go. There's no sound right now. So weird. I don't like music. Oh my god, do I get to ride a chocobo? And this joke? Oh, Thundir got it. Five points to Thundir. Told you she's there. Well, look who it is. Talk about a coincidence. What are you doing here? Waiting. Why? Because I'm not sick of you yet. Because she left. <laughs> she is cute. With pleasure. Ooh, the Final Fantasy VII theme. Do, do, do. Are you crying, you bitch boy? Something wrong? It's nothing. Oh. You little bitch boy, why are you crying? All right. You can see the sky. Chapter nine. Here we go. Oh, this music's really good. Back when they were still building Midgar, there was an accident, and the plate fell. People had only just started moving in. Turn up. Turn it up. So there weren't a lot Crank that time, shit. Good. Very fantasy. Ooh. And that's the underside of Sector Six. Walmart. A real special place. Baby, but let's go. I'm sure you already knew that, right? God, she's I tell you. I enlisted pretty much right <laughs> after I left home. Don't know much about this place, or any of the slums. Well, it took a lot of people to build Midgar. 
and they all needed to blow off steam. Oh, they made a wall market. Built an entertainment district. Inns, shops, bars, and maybe folks started pouring in from all over. Business was booming, money was flowing, which attracted the attention of some guys who didn't much care for the law. And now there isn't any. Right. But instead of trying to solve the problem, the government decided to just wall it in. And that's how Wall Market began. Now it's a crime it's ring. Out of mind, as the old saying goes. For the folks in charge, there's no better way to deal with it. So it's like a giant veil. Yeah. Wanna see what's behind it? Not really. That's good. Because I know a better way to get to Sector 7. One that, tragically, doesn't go through Wall Market. Damn, I wanted to go through Wall Market. Through we'll get our time. At least it was. Back when I was a kid. We'll get our time to go through the wall market. A whole little arc. Gotta go, we gotta go to the honeybee. By the way, this isn't the track that's a bop. This track is it, just really pretty. This is really good. Very like starry themed. It's, it is lovely. It really is beautiful. It is kind of crazy to me what Square Enix can do when they really put their heart into a product. Oh, I agree. And then they make shit like Wonderland or whatever. Collapsed Expressway. It's been Ugh, like this. The Collapsed you know, Expressway. Ugh. And there's no other way. It'll be an adventure. Like some Sonic music. Oh shit. I can listen to this music on loop for hours. And the combat music is also really good. But I, I like the non-combat music the most, but the combat music. Oh. Deal with that. Here goes. Oh, I need to hit them. Right, I kill you before I stagger you. Unfortunate. I'll protect you. I'm pretty good at protecting myself, you know. Are you? Why would you need a bodyguard if she's so good at protecting herself? Hmm? I got your number. Ask yourself that, Aerith. So it's my turn? Mm. This is gonna hurt. It's only been like 30 seconds of each track, which theme do you like more? Um, combat or non-combat? This combat one's really good. Oh, I staggered it. Let's go. Nice. Is Wait, are the battle intel things? I don't have any new ones yet. Just keep staggering things. It's What's good. That? You might have one more gone. stagger. I don't remember. Pretty cute, don't you think? Uh, What's that? A big arm? What does it fucking look like, idiot? That's basically the conversation that we just had. Local metal. Well, as long as that big arm, big arm, as long as that big arm doesn't attack me, I think we're fine. Oh great! Someone's pulled up the ladder. I get to move the arm. Move the arm. Sorry. I'm just jamming. <laughs> and just how the kids say, vibing. Yes. Is that what the kids say, guys? It's this way. Here's an idea. I'll hop on and you give me a ride. You serious? Absolutely. I'll throw down the ladder for you to climb up after. The kids don't say that. What are you talking about? I thought the kids said that. I'm pretty sure they do. The fact that the fingers flip from one to the other, I actually think is super clever. I mean, it's a machine. It doesn't have to worry about it. I know, right?
I just ran it in a billion times. Get the fuck off of here. He's a cake. Give me a sec. They actually, they actually very clearly mark on the well, ground where you uh, <laughs> can let Aerith on and off with yeah, the yellow lines. I know, but it was very funny. <laughs> I know, it's just funny, yeah. Um, both the second and third yeah. crane puzzles will feature a materia that you can get. Hmm? All right, good enough. Let's keep on trucking. Mm. <sighs> Again, they really tempt with the cuteness. Stop. Alright, let's just... I mean, I'll assess you, but it's just gonna say hit it with thunder. Like, yeah, no shit. Right, right. I already know, but Don't that's fine. Oh my god, I love this. Like, unironically, this is one... This is my favorite track from the game. I got this. Like, there's some really good music in this game, but the Collapse Expressway is my shit. <laughs> My goddamn jam. It really is. Oh my god, am I gonna stagger you before I kill you? Uh, focus thrust, just in case. Even then, I think that Thunder was doing more. Yep. That's fine. I think you've done most. Of, I'll look up the list of battle intels. I think you're you might be done explicitly needing to stagger things. I hope so. You have a few more, but I think they might be pretty flexible. Okay. Okay. You have. I don't know if you can get this one early. You have a stagger one where you need to increase the percentage beyond two hundred percent. I don't know. Yeah, I can't do that one yet. That one basically requires Tifa. Yeah, she's pretty good. You she's kind of nuts. Need to stagger forty different enemy types. That's the one that you can work on. So you do still need to. You do still. You do still want to stagger as many things as possible. Okay, you still want to. Yeah, because it will keep track of those for you. Oh, okay. So I should still be trying, even if I can't. <sighs> Alrighty. What's the maximum things I have to freaking? Total, you'll need to stagger 40 things. 40? You also need to assess 30 different enemy types. I'm assessing everything before I kill it. You should be good on the assess. Stagger. 16 weapon abilities, 12 We've types We've only done 15 materia. enemy types so far. Uh, that's just what the thing required. You've done more than that. It doesn't show you the extra that you've done. Um... You need to assess. Yeah, you're you're fine. You're on track. Stagger everything you can, but it like I, you can afford to miss a few things. Also, BRB for just a sec. Sorry. Deal with that. I'll take care of them. Hmm. Hey, you asked for it. Why don't you lead the way? Let's do this. One more shot. I'm coming. You'll see. Please, just stop it from spinning. That would be wonderful. Here. You'll see. Yoo -hoo. You're burning up. Bit by bit. You've got this. Taking over. This is, uh, interesting. Bam. I can't, like, do anything about that, because they just, like, keep spinning. And I can't, like, I can't stagger that for some reason. And I'm not entirely sure why. Okay, back. Welcome back. Yeah, the little spinning guys are hard to stagger. Yeah, I recall having trouble with them, and I don't even remember if I did stagger them. Spinny go vroom, hard to do. Yeah. Um, and for what it's worth, I believe, other than the two materia that will be pretty obvious to you as you progress through the Collapsed Expressway, mm -hmm. I don't think you have anything else to worry about in this area. 
basically the following two crane puzzles will feature materia that you can get mm-hmm. get those and I think that's all you need to worry about until you get to where you're going hmm is the bottom way to go the best way or the top way bottom way looks like a dead end the dead end but it's the treasure chest that I needed it's a mega potion let's go cool. oh god oh I made these things you're dead. so it's my turn I'm backing off a bit. Why don't you lead the way? What's really kind of interesting is I do so much damage with my magic, even though the Buster Sword has like no magic. That's kind of nutty, but it's fine. I mean, I imagine if Aerith had the right element equipped, she would do a lot of damage. Yeah, and then... But right now, you have Thunder on Cloud instead of on Aerith, which... I mean... Arguably, as much as you've been using Thunder, you probably should just put it on Aerith. Oh, shit, move! Oh, hey! Prayer Materia improved. Oh. Oh, well. It's fine. It's fine. Yeah, so you've got you, more than enough potions, so... Did you pre-order a physical copy for Xenoblade, or did you order digital? Uh, neither. What? Because the special edition stock, I never did get a special edition. Oh, okay. So you didn't and pre-order a regular copy? So I, didn't, I didn't pre-order anything at all. I'm just going to go to the store and grab one tomorrow. Worst case scenario, I'll just download digital. Oh, I, have okay. an errand, I have an errand to run in the morning that'll probably take me through about lunchtime. Okay. Jaden doesn't get off work until about four or so. And so if I if I go to Target and they don't have a copy, I'll go They'll have a copy. to Walmart. It's Xenoblade. It's not the hottest selling game in the world. They should have a copy. On the very off chance that they don't, then I will we will just order digital and it'll be no big deal. Yeah, okay. So Yeah, I've Hey, I bet you can grab that container. I haven't pre ordered many games. I've been trying to pre order less. Even Xenoblade, which I love. But I like, didn't gonna... pre-order Forbidden West. I went and picked it up. Yeah, I'm pretty sure I, I. If I did, I did it like the day before. Which like you technically... grabbed the special edition, so you. Can't... Oh yes, I did. You're right. You're absolutely right. I did. Oh no, I did pre-order. I I got it from Best Buy. Never mind. Yes. yes. So that's the only thing I've pre-ordered in a while. Last one was Persona Strikers. Did you hmm. finish that game? I never finished it. No. <laughs> The Dynasty Warriors stuff, we were playing Hyrule Warriors as well. I was getting a little burnt out on the oh, Hyrule yeah. Warrior experience. Oh, or the no. Dynasty Warrior experience. Why is it always gotta be so tough? Lucky for me, you'll make this easier. They really want to focus on that cute face. They do that a lot. They show her face a lot in this game. They do. They do. Well then, I'm gonna head down. All right, so I gotta lower this, drop this off over here. Nope, put off over here. Place the container. Gotta go over here, grab her. For a ride. And then I gotta place her over by the materia, I'm guessing? Yes. I take it I didn't need to put the container down over by the materia? I don't know. So she can walk across? You'll have to see. I don't know. I am pretty sure you needed to place the container, personally. Oh, this is annoying. Yeah. It's just right there. Just walk off and get it. I know. I know. I know. Silly, silly. They're like, oh, we're gonna get this puzzle here for you. But yeah, sure, a nice puzzle, dog. Ah, yes, now you can see that there is a place to let her off of on the top of the container. 
Who would have guessed? I like how if you watch the if you watch the hand, the fingers just flip around, but the thumb just takes like, where it is. Well, no, the thumb has to. I think in one of the animations, it like actually flips around. It may only be when you grab the 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 crate, but yeah, the thumb is different. I do not understand why you have to drop her off right there. You could just drop her off I, at the goddamn. I know. Just <sighs> just let it just let it be. Uh, An orb of binding materia. Yes. The fuck is that? Binding. Uh. That's I've... slow. Stop. No, no, that's a time materia. Binding is. What is binding? Camera in this section is worthy of praise. Oh, this camera can go bite my butthole. What is binding materia? What? Alright, I got the one materia. Okay, right yep. There. Binding. Because binding is not. You get barrier material. You might already have that one. She just kicks the ladder. She's like, yeah. I know, right? Please go down faster than this cloud. Thank you. You can run down the ladder, yeah. Move the metal. Mm-hmm. Yeah, now you know what they're for, and you're like, mm, weapon SP, I want. I got the weapon SP. Cloud, over here! All right, I'm coming. Yeah, the... The container was blocking the way before. Now you can just walk through. We oh, dead end, dead end, dead end, dead end. Usually means stuff. Whoa! End. Not too fast, okay? Got it. I know that was actually one of the things I was reading the developer interviews for Xenoblade Three today. One of the things they talked about was the decision to include the navigation feature, which basically draws you a draws that you a little line. It draws you a line to your goal That's and they fun. they debated on whether or not they should include it or not because they want to encourage people to take detours but they also don't want people to feel like they're lost but it sounds like what sold them was that for some people the adventure the adventure line the the line will be the way to determine which way is forward so they can ignore the distracting side paths but for Anybody some people uh oh is this story it, Yes, yes, you actually, this is actually the story. Damn. But for some people, the, the, the navigation will be a way to ensure that they don't advance Still story more. until they're ready by showing them which way is the correct way and then allowing them to then choose the wrong way to go yep. to take all those detours. Besides, so it's a double-edged sword. Some people will inevitably skip half the content of the game by using the navigation feature and be like, man, this game was so boring. There was hardly anything in it. Oh yeah, the dumb, the dumb thugs got it. Compensatory damages is like, uh, it's like compensation for damages. Oh yeah, that's what you get when you, no, when somebody else. We haven't done anything wrong. Yeah, we were just passing through. They're so stupid. Oh, a likely story. Uh, okay, what do you want? Nothing but our due recompense, that's all. <laughs> due recompense, due recompense, due, due recompense. No, due recompense. It's like, uh, it's like, uh, uh, these, these three are miserable. Hot take. I don't like stupid characters. I agree. They're super annoying. I find them to be infuriating. There's a character in Xenoblade, there's a Blade in Xenoblade 2 who's like that, and I just, he's my, she is my least favorite character, and a lot of people love her. They're like, oh, this character is my favorite, and I cannot stand her. Bro, these guys are weak as fuck. They are actually really weak. I don't mind, like, himbo energy, but these guys are just explicit. Like, their whole thing is they're stupid, and that's their whole character. I can't stand that. All right, well, that was the easiest thing in the world. Yeah. Okay, guys, whatever you do, don't move. So if I leave and then come back, will they be gone? 
They're a unique fight, yeah. Okay. I need to go back this way to see if I missed anything. Yeah, like, I'm okay with the, like, well-meaning but stupid characters, your himbo whatevers, but those guys are... The people that are just like, I can't remember anything, or I don't know what words mean. Like, yeah. fuck... But fuck off. Fuck off. I, that's just, not interesting to just me. Just fuck off. You're dumb. We get it. Cool. You're like the fat guy who's hungry all the time. Right. Like, uh, but I don't know. The stupid characters in particular just grind my gears in a way that I can't stand. Oh, I could have just gone up here, healed, and grabbed the music that I was going to miss. Mm -hmm. Oh, I'm glad we went here anyways. Because the one thing I, I didn't write down music... Uh, as missable because technically it doesn't you don't lose anything for Ooh, not getting Cosmo it. Canyon right weird that they included that there's a bunch of themes that are weird that they included in my opinion actually unfortunately really kind of a good like natural wind down spot after that unique fight right um I'm not sure how much we can trek through in 10 minutes or so. You have another crane puzzle. Can we get to it? You should. This The Collapsed Expressway is not long. Let's get to it, then. It is, it is the third and final crane puzzle. Then we're probably pretty close. We should be done by 10 or 10.10 at latest. I've been going to bed like a dummy idiot. Oh, uh, well, I gotcha. Part of it has been the rain the past couple of days. It's been raining at night, and then walking the dogs in the rain has been kind of annoying. Yeah. I had to walk them in the rain this morning because it was just Do you have like a legit? Do you have like a legit big raincoat? No. You that probably would be worth the investment. Yeah. Yeah, it would. My like wife a does. real. She has a nice raincoat. It's a small rain. It's not like real big and poofy, but it's a nice raincoat, and it has. Don't leave me, I'm coming! I actually wore mine today when I went and got coffee. Um, it's nice and it has, a uh, um, Miko and Flick from, uh, Pocahontas on it. Oh! The one, I, the one I wore was ironic because it's one of the little, it's one of the few pieces of branded company, like, swag that I have. For the company I work for, mm -hmm. but we rebranded officially today. We're a different, our company's a different name, so it's like it is officially outdated. It's an old logo and stuff. But yeah, having a, legit, bandits. having a legit sushi waterproof raincoat is actually solid. If you can stagger these guys, it's good, but at, if you, you may not be able to. I think they stagger with fire, but I could be wrong. Yeah, yeah magic. I might. Honestly, wind might be best because I don't think I kill them. I kill them too quickly. Wind might be the weakest magic. Though. I don't think they're weak to it or anything, but I don't know. It's not a huge deal. You will you will almost certainly get that without too much difficulty. You have plenty of fights left with interesting and different enemies, some of which you're almost guaranteed to stagger. So it's not. There we go. I can I can stagger this one if I hit its arm instead of its main body. Yeah. Or maybe not. I hit its arm and kill its arm, and apparently that didn't um, do what I what didn't it actually stagger it. Well, just it didn't focus. stagger. It, it got its stagger meter up. Yeah, just focus thrust over and over. Yeah, kind of. And miss, again, I miss having two have... Once you have Tifa again, she has a lot better tools in her kit for getting stagger. His arm's back up, too. There we go. Got it. Five SP gained. All yeah. Right. Here is the um, last puzzle. Mm -hmm. There's another materia. This one's really good. It better be. It's blue. Mm-hmm. So There's it's not, like utility. Not very many blue ones. It's like utility material. Mm-hmm. God. Potions. 
Oops. Yeah. So many potions. Yeah, it would be nice if they let you use multiple at once out yeah, of battle. that'd be kind of nice. I, I have to do this all the time. Like, I, like, I get it, but also, it would Stupid be nice. Ladders. Always out of <laughs> Stupid ladders, I agree. You're in charge of the arm, got it? I agree, Aerith. Stupid ladders in fucking need. Alright. Oh, the music changed too. Mm -hmm. This is no longer the Collapse Expressway music. That's like or maybe a, it is. It's like a maybe bandit it's, theme. Version. Or it could be the break in the middle of it. I have to do the other one first. Should have known they were gonna pull the classic video game thing. Like, ah, ha, 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 ha. Grab that container. Bring it over. Place it down. Nope. Keep going. Come on. What the hell do you mean you can't place it? Okay, so they both are stuck on something? What the hell am I doing wrong here? Uh, well, I'll let you figure it out. I'm not, well, I don't know why I tried to solve the puzzle for you. Ugh, you stupid. I gotta stack both of these up so she can get up there. Move over, change the arm, grab the thing, do the stuff. You can you can see that the the first crate Oh no, they both have it. Never mind. They both have the little They have the yellow on top of it. Yeah. Right, now we change arms, and we lower the arm down, and we go for a ride. It's this way. I know which way it is, Aerith. <gasps> so bossy. Oh, but then I'm gonna have to put a crate up there. So she can get up there. I can't look. Can I? Can this go all the way over? Can. But I don't just drop her off here. I have to crate there. So I'm guessing. Right? Yep. She won't just climb up. She won't. Okay. All right. Fine. You're just loving this, aren't you? What are you doing? For a podcast, he's just chilling, vibing by himself. Like, Joe just like... I'm looking at Twitter. It's... Don't do Xenoblade that. Xenoblade Day. It's Don't Xenoblade do Day. Don't do that. I have... I have saw on Twitter that there are people who are um, posting spoilers without tagging. Uh, that doesn't surprise me. So I um, would honestly avoid Twitter for a little while. Yeah, the problem is, is that here's the problem with the whole situation, is that if people are posting spoilers about the end game, the problem is, uh, like, it's gonna take us a while to beat the game. Yeah. So like, it, it's probably gonna take us like a month. <laughs> yeah. Like, it's a long game. We're gonna do all the content, and so I, it's gonna be really hard, downright impossible to like not I don't know it's gonna be it's gonna be tough we're gonna try to stay ahead of most people but of course there are people who broke street date 
and have already somehow beaten the game. Like, there are people out there who got the game early and who have already beaten the game. Those people exist. And so, it's just going to be hard. Whoa. But I don't actually follow that many content creators. I don't know. I don't follow the type of people who I think would spoil it. So, what are you woeing about? Oh, Max posted in our Monster Hunter chat. He got three mantles oh. from a drop. Wow, that's, I mean, Jesus, Like, from one crazy. hunt. That's crazy. That game is so good. Rise like I said, has I, been I don't, super fun. I don't think I'm going to play Rise, but I saw some stuff. There were, like, supposed leaks about a future title that maybe is a full title. Maybe it's an expansion. We don't know. Really? Yeah. Oops. Oh, did we not talk about this? Magnify! Yes, Magnify is so good. Magnify, like, Magnify is actually busted. It's it's incredibly good. Um, but yeah, there was something about on the official Monster Hunter Discord channel. There was like a channel post. There was so people found evidence of something associated with a new Monster Hunter something. Is and it like, a title update? No. Um, what is it? Because um, it'd be weird for them to be in development of it. Well, I mean, I guess they could be in development while Sunbreak is out. That would that would be fine, right? Because Sunbreak is out, then they're going to do a couple title updates that gets them into like holiday season of next year where they just drop another game. What they have is basically Discord data mines seem to indicate that there are channels that exist which are not public yet. And what they know is that we have something called Monster Hunter Paradise. Now, what is that? Oh, please don't be like an MMO fucking that, like to me that like name, Dauntless or that Dauntless name whatever it's could called. Be a second expansion to Rise, though I doubt that's the case. I doubt that's the case. It could be a full brand new title. Maybe it's maybe it's the sequel to World, right? Maybe it's like a direct sequel to World. Oh, you're kind of cool. Could make sense. Uh, World or, is good. or it's a mobile game, or it could be. Could be a mobile game. It could but... be all, or it could be. It could fucking be their new service for fucking screenshots. Like we don't know. <laughs> I'm assuming though, like, have you heard of Dauntless at all? I don't know. I don't know. A lot, a lot of people maybe have, but it's uh, like it's like a free-to-play, grindy Monster Hunter game. Mm -mm. I don't uh, know it. Um, and kind of the style. It came out around Fortnite when like the free-to-play hype games were were out and going crazy. And so I'm I'm really hoping it's not going to be like that. Uh, but I don't know. Like Capcom has been really. Um, Careful with monster. Because it's very the the audience that does Monster Hunter are very particular. Yeah, it, it could be also it could be like a new stories type spinoff game. Oh hell yeah, give me another stories game. Right, we don't know, but the like, point is something called Monster Hunter Paradise is probably going to exist. Probably fairly soon. Probably whenever they're done with Sunbreak. So who knows? Like TBD, we don't know yet. That went pretty um, sure did. But yeah. Uh, huh? Wait a minute. Did you just? Nope. Nope. What an edgy boy. Doesn't want to admit that he has feelings. Don't worry. We'll be on the same page next time. What are you talking about? I'm sorry. Okay. These two's interactions are pretty. Hold it right there, lovebirds. You want to pass through our territory? Then you gotta pay the toll. Okay. Does the toll like open your fucking ass? Looks like it's whooping your ass. Oh look, another loading zone. Mm-hmm. It's an open world. Mm. It's not. 
I mean, that's... I don't care. I know, I don't care either. The illusion is good. Why do I have to hold this for so long? I also don't understand why holds are so long. It's like throughout the entire game, hold commands are really long. I don't know why. Oh, it's the playground! Mm-hmm. Right, this guys. scene is really sweet. The gate to Sector 7. Yeah, this is actually in the original. How do we open it? More importantly, how about we take a break? Sound good? No. I don't have time. Up there looks nice. Yeah, this is actually in the original game. Come on. <sighs> Dude, all the imp all the master rank monsters are like you know, gigantic. A long time ago, I used to sell flowers here. Oh yeah. Oh, she scooched. How cute. So, Cloud, you were a soldier first class, right? No. Yeah. Weird. Really? What's weird about it? Nothing. Just that you were the same rank. Huh? As who? As a little That's friend. Yeah. What's his name? I probably know him. Oran. Mm. Are you okay? What's his name? Wow. Your eyes. Oh. It's because of the Mako. All soldiers have them. Yeah, I know. Sorry, I'm bumming you out. We should go. <sighs> Gotta look forward, not back. That's a good, this is a good Continue. I know, I know, I hate it because there's. I know what's coming up next, but this is a really good place to stop. Do you, do you know who Eric was in love with? Does that get I, revealed? I can make an assumption based on context. What's your assumption? Uh, I mean, I'll DM you. Probably smart. I'm really looking forward to uh, Crisis Core because um, I want to see if they do anything with it. Because uh, it tells it it uh, I, it sets up. Uh, I know it sets up everything so well. I I think that you should you need to finish this game too. Uh, I mean I'm gonna finish this game. Crisis Core doesn't come out till later this year. No, I know, I know, I know. You you you'll... right? Is it this year? I actually think it is this year. I think it's it like is this year, right? Winter. I think they said winter 2022. Yeah, we'll finish this game before winter 2022. Oh, New Zealand play tweet. What's this? What's this? What's this? What's this? <laughs> it's it for content. Uh, it's just more trailer stuff that, frankly, I'm not going to watch because, like. Why? Uh, Why would I do that? At this point, I'm, I'm going to play the game tomorrow. I don't need to see it. Shit. All right, guys. That's gonna be it for us today. What a what a ride. Good conversation. Funny pictures that we show. So join the Discord down below if you're not yeah. already there. Thanks everybody for watching. It was a good time. We next week is gonna be so much fun because next week is a really good part of the story. Yeah, we should. So we were originally thinking, I don't know what you think is gonna happen next, but um we were originally thinking we weren't gonna be able to do next week, but I found out like 
when my flight gets in at like 1.30. By the time I'm offloaded, get to the airport, get to my car, I'll be home at like 4.35-ish. So if anything, we might be starting like half an hour later, but we'll probably still play. Like, yeah, barring barring any delays. Yeah, unless anything. my flight is like majorly delayed, I don't, which I don't see because next, like where we live, it's supposed to be fine. So it would be New Orleans weather that would like freak it out. But um, so everything should be pretty okay as long as for that matter. And I will get to talk about Xenoblade next week. Oh, God. I mean, I get to talk about Xenoblade tomorrow. <laughs> All like, really? All right, guys. Thanks so much for joining us. Subscribe, like, Patreon. All fans. the things. We haven't done that in a while, but hey, for those season like one listeners, there you go. There you go. Which are the people that are in this room? <laughs> I don't know. Thanks, everybody. We'll see you later. Bye.